One, two, one, two. Yes, sir. What's up? What's up? Welcome to the War Zone, people. We are here. Let's go. Let's go. One, two. All right, we waiting on man. Where they at? Where they at? Oh, so we waiting on seven thirty. Yo, Scotty boy is in the house. Scotty, man, we got like twenty minutes, man, but I'm still here, man. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna hang out. They said six o'clock, man, and um. Yeah, they're tripping, bro. They always do that to me, man. As a matter of fact, man. Wow, man. Jeez, man. Scotty, I might have to come back, man. Oh no, I'm gonna stick it out, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with it. I'm gonna go with it. Nah, they're not starting at the same time, Scotty, man. Two fights got canceled. Are they still starting at the same time? Ah, no, nah, they're not actually. I see. But um, I'm still here, man. Okay. 
Let me get it right here, man. Oh, Scotty Boy said two fights got canceled. That's not good. Ah, oh, man. I had to get some coffee, man. I had a late night last night. I was watching. I got caught up watching Gotham Garage, man. Watching them build them cars and stuff, man. I was like... I said, I'm just going to have to deal with it. Jamal. <laughs> What is coffee is good. So what's been going on, Scotty, man? What you got going on today, man? What you got for um you got some bets in today? I got it. Oh man, I gotta go check. I think I I might have I might have messed up, man. Oh man, I, I know I didn't get no. Please don't let it happen, bro. Please don't let me have any. Oh my god. Yep. Okay, 86. I have to replace that guy. Oh, yeah, man. I see the fights. Oh, they screwed me over, man. Oh, jeez, man. Screwed my whole line up, up, man. Oh, man. Okay. I got time, though. 88. Oh, that's screwed up. I see it now, man. Kenny Luke, Michael and Hill. Awesome, bro. Mm. Oh, that's what's up. That's a good parlay, bro. That is really good, bro. Yeah, I think I think Hill's gonna. I I think Hill's a good favorite, man. He's a. Yeah, man. I'm on DraftKings. I got I got to redo my lineups because of the um, the cancellations, man. I wanted to see that Kinlon guy fight, man. He was an excellent guy to take, man. Excellent fighter to take, bro. And he he's he's oh man, he's out. So I gotta, I gotta, I gotta um, fix them up. I gotta fix up my lineup now. Oh man! Shoot. Okay, Luke McKinney, Walker, Sato. Got McKinney. Who else I want on here, man? Jeez. Thank God I got time, bro, to fix this. Sam Alvey. I'm going to go with Olusay Chuck, man, over Sam Alvey, man. Or should I go with Brian? No, I'm going with OSA Chuck. Boom. 
And I'm taking Sato out of there. 76. Man, I, I, nah, that's not good. Jeez, this is ugly for me. This is going to be ugly for me. I think I'm going to go with Usman, man. Jeez, this is ugly. All right, that's two lineups. Gosh, man, I got it. Kuchiera. God, man, this is ugly. Tatara's in the house. I see you, bro. Yeah, man. Forgive me, man. We, we're going to be, it, it's going to start in a few, man. Um, Dad, they canceled a couple of fights, so it's going to start just a little bit later. But uh, I'm here, man, so. I'm just fixing my DraftKings uh, lineups right now because they, they screwed me over, man.
Wow, man, I have to redo all of my f joints, man. Jeez. I got to do a new one, man. Got to do a new one. Jeez, this is going to be ugly. Wow. Wow. Yep. That's it. Wow, what time does the car start, man? Yeah, man. Can either 40 minutes. Yeah, man. I'm here, man. I'm just hanging out, man. But yeah, it's gonna it's gonna start at um I think it's gonna start um 7 30, man. Seven thirty, seven thirty. I just happened to come in, so I'm I'm just gonna hang out, man. Yeah, yeah, seven thirty. But we in here, man. We in here. We gonna be in here for a little bit. But, um, yeah, man, um, so I'm just going through, man, and uh, checking on some things, man. All right, so yeah, I got everything here. Everything is there, man. Jeez. Let's go. Oh, man, I went crazy in boxing, bro. Nine of ten. 
What? Let's go. Seven of nine. Wow, man. I'm killing them in boxing right now. Let me go. Let me go to boxing, man. I'm going to see if I can catch that last fight, man. Let me catch this last fight here. Let's see what we got here. Conlin versus Mariaga. Oh, that's a good one, bro. Took Michael Conlin in that one, man, by decision. Jeez, man, I went crazy in boxing. Oh, okay. ZMVP, he says, thanks. Had to check it out. Okay, both other outlets say 40 minutes. QA says, um, MVP says, thanks. Had to check Check it out. It's 1121 for me. Okay, okay. Where you at, MVP? Where you, where you live at, man? Are you in Europe somewhere or? Yeah, I'm on US time, man. East Coast USA time. Yeah, our guys, my guys must know, you know, the normal, um, my normal guys. So, so they'll, they'll be in here, man, by that time, man. So we're going to be in here chatting it up, man, and uh, going at it, man, because we got a fantasy league, man. If you, you guys are interested, man, check in the uh, description below, man, and go to my uh, Facebook page, man, and, um, Join the group, man, and we'll sign you up for our fantasy, man. We we play for prizes and all. And um doesn't matter where you're at in the world, man. We'll send you we'll send you the prize. And uh have some fun, man, and talk some smack in here, man. You'll see once the guys get in here, man, that the, the um, regular guys come in here, man. And, uh, yeah, man, come a part of the community, man, and uh, subscribe to the channel, man. Hit the bell icon, man. We go live may maybe t um, once or twice a week. I see the card coming up now. The card's coming up. I mean, well, they're showing highlights of it right now. Santos versus Hill. Yeah, that be that's coming up, man. We we we're gonna be live in a few. I'm a little early, man. I, it says six o'clock. I didn't realize they had canceled two bouts. So, Wow, I don't see the um 
I don't see the boxing coming up. It might be over with. It might be over with. Ortiz versus McKinson. Oh, Virgil Ortiz Jr. That's right. Wow, I want to see that fight, bro. It's probably going to be over quick. I took uh, Ortiz by KO, man. Let me go to the page here and see if I can find it, bro. Yeah, we're live, man. But uh, we got some good matchups, man. Um, I'm going to check out my boys real quick to see if they're live doing this fight. Yeah, I see my boys on right now. Let me uh let me go check in with them and see. So Check out boy right quick. Let's see. Oh, okay. So they're just, uh, I see it. Bet MMA tips. Yeah, I got it on here, man. Um, Q&A. Let me uh, pull it up real quick. Let's see. Yeah, I got it up, man. Yeah, I do. Um, I do um prediction videos, man, as well, man. I do really, really well, man. I actually win every week, so so yeah, I got uh.
Yep. I'm going to tell you, a key fight is that McKinney versus um, Gonzalez, man, Eric Gonzalez. Great odds, though. Uh, in that Hill fight, I think Hill can can beat Tiago Santos. I think he, with his height and length, he can stay at range. Um, I like Vincent Luque against Jeff Neal. Uh, Puaga against Usman. Uh, that's going to be a really good fight. If Usman can just throw those big shots and stay on the outside and keep from getting taken down, man, he's got a shot. But uh, I give the edge to Puaga in that fight. Um, Brogan Walker, Juliana Miller, that's a pretty much a pick em, But I think experience-wise, Brogan Walker is the pick. But Juliana Miller is tall. She's got great jujitsu, And... Um, that's going to, that's going to, that's, she's got the height advantage. So that's going to be tough, but uh, Brogan Walker with the experience might be the pick there, man. Um, Servigay Spivak versus uh, Sakai. I got to go with Spivak. I think Spivak will stop Sakai at some point, man. Sakai's just uh, very, he's been, he's been stopped too many times, man. Terrence McKinney is definitely a lock against Eric Gonzalez, man. I love Terrence McKinney and his, um, his, his his style, bro. Um, just great all the way around. The guy can grapple. He can strike. Explosive. Eric Gonzalez is solid, but I just think that Terry McKinney has that fight. Michael Olasechek versus Sam Alvey. Got to go with Olasechek. Sam Alvey's a little over the hill. I think he's seen his better days. Uh, could see a stoppage in that fight. Takashi Sato versus Brian Battle. I think Brian Battle is proving to be, uh, he's just tall, rangy. He's got decent wrestling, and he can, um, he's got that jab, man. He's got, he's got a four-inch reach advantage in that fight, height advantage. I don't see Sato winning that fight. Got to go with Brian Battle in that one, man. Corey McKenna, Miranda uh, Granger. Got to go with Corey McKenna in that fight to edge that fight out. It's going to be tough. Bueno Silva versus Stephanie Egger. That was a pick em fight for me, man. But, ah, man, that's tough. I'm giving the edge to Stephanie Egger in that one, man. Um, but Bueno Silva's tough. Could go either way, but I think Stephanie Egger, you know, people are sleeping on her in that fight. Uh, you know, they say style makes fights, so gotta gotta consider her in that fight, bro. Yeah, gotta go with uh gotta go with that, man.
Yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Well, well, um, I just go on there, man, for really for um stats and and uh on bet MMA, man. Um, but I'm under war zone seven three seven. All capitals seven three seven war zone seven three seven on there. Um, I don't I don't really bet because it's out of my juris dis, jurisdiction on there, out of my jurisdiction. But uh, I do go there and uh, check out. You know, I keep track of how the 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 odds move uh, during the fights and all of that. But uh, I'm pretty much a DraftKings guy because of the area that I'm in, man. Um, DraftKings is the only one who really allows me to uh, bet. And I usually on DraftKings, I do lineups. And I win every single week, bro. Um, I just had to go through and change them up just now. But, uh, yeah, man, I got like one, two, three, four five six i got six lineups going right now for uh for this uh for tonight so yeah so it's uh yeah Yep, 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 yep. That's what I got, man. Let's see here. Wow. Yeah, Marlo Sparza, I like her. She's 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 God, I hate that they that they cancel those fights, man. Jeez. I had Josh Keenlon, man, knocking out Jason Witt. He was he was that he was just that key piece to my lineups, man. Um Cochiera and and Lipsky. I had Cochiera in that one, man. Oh my God. It screwed me over. Took those two fights out, man. That was that was ugly. Sakai, Spivak, 88. Wow. Yeah, man, I got to go through these. Let's see, Santos. Ah, man. Dag, that Terrence McKinney fight, man. Oh.
Wow, man, this is tough. This is really tough. Oh, man, this is really tough, bro. Okay, so you got Usman Mabuku, Spivak, Kenny Walker, right? Angel, Granger. Let's see, McKinney, McKinney. I'm sorry, guys, man. I have to go through and change these lineups up, man. Brogan, Granger, oh, 73, Luke. Oh. Jamal Hill. Edgar. Wow, man, this is ugly for me, man. Oh, man, I got to go through this with a fine tooth comb, bro. Wow, man, this is ugly for me. Oh, man, Usma, I don't go with Jess for Neo. Wow, man, this is ugly for me, man. Having to switch up these cards, bro. That just made it tough for me, man. Made it tough for me, but I think I got him, bro.
Kenny Usman, Speed Rock, Luke A. Hill. All right. We're going we're gonna to go with these, man. We're going to run with these. RKH is in the house, man. Oh, man. What's up, bro? Yeah, Scotty boy, man. Scotty boy says, yeah, they should have started the fights at the same time. Because this, yeah, this way is killing me, bro. This, this is crazy, man. It makes me sick, bro. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense, man. I, I'm sitting here running unnecessary time man off of uh off of my um stream yard bro it's all good man it's all good i use obs and stream yard both so it doesn't matter if i if i run out of uh, air time for this i got plenty but it just doesn't make any sense to be running man for no reason it's my fault i should have i should have checked i should have checked man i i assumed that it was still coming on it's going to be on at six o'clock but two fights got canceled so let's get it let's go rkh in the house rkh man who you got man give me give me some wrestling names man Let's talk wrestling, man. Who, who, anybody who knows anything about WWE, WWF, you, you already know what it is. RKH, man, give me some names, man. Yesterday you was like Adrian Adonis. I was like, oh man, Adrian Adonis was that dude, bro. Oh, Hank Lundy. I don't know why I'm not able to get these fights. Come on in, man. Come in, fights. Yeah, we're on the prelims, man. We got Hank Lundy fighting. Let me go check uh, tap, man, and see where we at, man. I like Virgil Ortiz Jr., man. This guy's 18 and old, man. This guy's got... All KOs, bro. He's 18 and over with 18 KOs, bro. It's a problem, bro. He's fighting uh, Michael McKinson, man. They're fighting in... Um... Fort Worth, man, in Texas. Hank Lundy about to get knocked out. That's what he about to get, man. Lunging in and acting stupid. 
He needs to slow it down, bro. Wow. Lundy caught him and dropped him. Lundy came to fight. Wow. Wow, bro. Wow, man, I went undefeated on draft on um both of my boxing cards on tapology jeez good job Let me see here, Bet USA, boom.
Man, this is weird. I can't get it, man. All right, guys, we got we got about a half hour to go, man, before we start this card, man. I'll tell you what, man, that Nunez Pena two fight, man. Oh my God, did she dominate Juliana Pena? She beat her up bad, bro. Sent her to the hospital right away, bro. Yeah, you got to put Ronda Rousey on the Mount Rushmore women's fighters. Ronda Rousey, Amanda Nunez, um, Valentina Shevchenko, and I would have to say for that fourth spot, I had to put Kayla, Kayla Harrison's got to be on that Mount Rushmore, man. Yeah, you got to put Ronda up there, man. Man and Nunez, that would be the GOAT right now, man. Still the GOAT. Just just because of what she done, man. Two, 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 um, two belt champ. Got to put her in there. Yeah, oh, they got they got three of the ones that I've already called, man. Valentina's up there. Yeah. The next has got to be Kayla Harrison, man, but they're probably not because they're talking UFC. UFC, they're probably going to probably put it, put Thug Rose up there, man. Thug Rose is probably going to be Rose Nama Nunez. Well, she put Rose on me.
All right, man, let's go. Let me catch this fight, man. Let me see what we got here, bro. Hank Lundy right now trying to take this kid's head off, but, but, Hank Lundy look like he's slowing down a little bit right now, man. <clears throat> yeah, here we go. Round five.
I think I think this guy settled in, Martin, man, and he's pretty much got Lundy's um I like what this kid's doing now. He's out boxing Lundy now. Salute, Devin Block is in the house. Salute, family. What's up, man? Yeah, we're a little early, man. We we about to kick it off in about 15 minutes, man. They canceled a couple of fights, man, and um, was unaware of it, man. And uh, so we starting we starting in about 15, 15 minutes, man. Uh, I'm sitting here watching the uh, Hank Lundy against um, Alex Martin fight. Lundy already dropped this kid, but kid's coming back, man. He's won the last couple of rounds, so let's see if he can keep it going, man. But well, Lundy came out hammering, bro. Hammering Hank came out hammering. Kids seem to settle down now, though. Virgil Ortiz and Michael McKinson. That's going to be a KO, man. Yeah, Hank done moved to the undercars. <laughs> yeah, man. Hank, Hank done moved to the undercards. Come on, Hank, man. Nice shots coming in from Martin right now. He's putting together his hands now. Hank. Hank don't Hank Hank don't quite no he ain't adjusted right yet man he getting his head boxed off right now but uh this kid better be careful don't let him land that that big left hand. Nice jab coming in from Martin. And he's throwing a lot of rabbit punches, too, Lundy is. This kid throwing them back, too. These, these, yo, these dudes is corny as hell, bro. These commentators, man, they, they're saying Lundy, Lundy's not winning. He hasn't won the last couple of rounds, bro. He has not won the last couple of rounds, bro. He landing that jab on Lundy. Lundy ain't doing nothing right now, man. This kid got to watch that left hand, though, man, Lundy, man. But he's throwing that jab right in Lundy's face, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, Devin, man. Virgil going to knock this kid out, bro. 
early. Under five. He gonna knock him out under five. It might be two. I know I got him knocking him out. I think I got him in like four. Four or three. And they keep saying Martin's defensive, being defensive. He's landing on Lundy. What is y'all seeing, bro? Don't you see these jabs? They just they just on Lundy's jock strap right now, man. Like Lundy's really winning this fight, bro. Like I mean, I mean, he's maybe still ahead. I think the kid last won the last three rounds. So I think Lundy's probably up by one round right now, maybe. Or it could be even. You know what I mean? Come on, man. They they just oh Lundy, Lundy, Lundy. Lundy hasn't done anything in the last three rounds, bro. And this is a golden boy fighter, man. This Martin kid, and they still ain't they they ain't giving him no props, bro. They should be talking, trying to talk him up, man. And they they talking him down. Lundy, Lundy, Lundy. I'm like, get out of here, bro. All right, Martin, man, you got to let your hands go, bro. All right, Martin, you better step it up this round, man. Trying to fall behind this round. I don't like how Martin's throwing shots and then he's waiting. He's, I, I guess he's just... All right, the footwork, footwork of Martin's. All right, Martin, don't get complacent here. All that boy got to do is just keep shooting that jab out there on Lundy, man. Stay out of range of that left hand, Alundi, because you. Good shot by Martin, bro. Good left hand. Lundy can't outbox this kid, man. He just can't outbox him, man. Big shot from Martin at the end of that round, bro. Good body shots and another overhand left. Good, good round for Martin, man. I think he's won the last four rounds.
Oh, well, Lundy this, Lundy that. Lundy, Lundy ain't doing nothing, man, right now, man. He can definitely keep fighting like this, man. He's going to win this fight, man. Lundy trying to hit him in the back of the head. Now he got he got his range down. This 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 Martin kid. He just got to watch out for that that old looping left hand from Lundy, man. Nice body work from uh, Martin, man. Nice body work. Nice body shots from Martin, man. And they still they still talking Lundy up. He might get the upset win over him. He's been he he ain't doing nothing. He hasn't done anything since. Nice body shot and a one-two from Martin. Another body shot. Good job, man. Got them all off balance now. Beating Lundy up, man, right now, man. Just keep going to the body, man. Lundy just, look at Lundy just acting silly. This kid's been winning every round since, man. Lundy missing. Lundy getting beat every round since. This kid should be ahead right now, man. Lundy is getting outboxed right now, bro.
Oh, nice combination from Martin right now. Nice combination from Martin. Oh, big right hand from Lundy, but then this kid comes back with a combination. Wow, I got to watch them headbutts. It's a close round so far. Lundy slowed down big time, though. This kid just need to move, man. Nice, nice double jab by Martin. Nice jab. Money ain't doing enough, man. Yeah, but making him making him making him move doesn't make him win the round, bro. He's talking about Lundy's controlling the fight. He's not con controlling the fight is winning the fight. He's not he's not winning lately, man. All right, Martin, man, you need this last round, man. Nice body shots from Martin. Another body shot. Another body shot. Another body shots.
good combination lands for Martin. <laughs> he just took Lundy down to the ground, bro. That UFC takedown. Look at Lundy. Lundy, look at Lundy taking time to get up. Lundy, Lundy ain't feeling right. L Lundy, L they calling timeout now. Lundy, Lundy hurt. He hurt. <laughs> 22 seconds left. Oh, he got him in a guillotine. He took Lundy down in a guillotine. I think Martin won all the last of them rounds, man. I think he pulled it out. Could be a draw, man. He might try to call it a draw, but I think Martin won. Lundy, Lundy got his knockdowns and stuff early. He got aggressive early, but he 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 slowed down. Yeah, I think Martin uh fought his way back in this one, man. But they try, they may give it to Lundy. Who knows? We'll see. We will see. Lundy gonna be Lundy gonna be mad if he lose this fight. All right, here we go, baby. UFC. Ninety eight, ninety one. Yep. Yeah, Martin won. I knew he won. I knew he beat. I knew he won. Unanimous decision. Yeah. He survived that knockdown. He just shut Hank Lundy out the rest of the fight, man. I saw it with my own eyes. All right, so we got UFC. We on now, y'all. UFC is popping. 
Jamal Hill and 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 Tiago Santos, boy, and that's that that stare down was crazy, bro. As you guys seen in the thumbnail, man, these guys is woo. So we on pre-fight right now, baby. Let's go. All right, here we are, man. We're live, baby. We're live. Let's go. All right, here we go, y'all. We on, man. We on it. It's on. We're live right now, baby. So we about to get this first match popping off, man. Let's get it. Let's get it. Come on, come on, come on. All right, we about to kick off the first match. Myra Bueno Silva versus Stephanie Edgar. Wow, they they first uh Silva started off as the favorite in this, but then it switched to Edgar, man. So 
We're going to see, man. Edgar, Edgar's probably coming in here to grapple, man. All right, so we waiting, man. We waiting on this first match to come up, man. Right now, let's get it. All right, now let's go. We live, baby. We are live. All right, let's get it popping, man. All right, let's go. Here we go. Here we go, yo. Here we go, yo. We live right now, man. Trying to get it popping, bro. Yeah, but you're showing Tiago Santos, man, when he was uh, healthy, man. This guy's got two reconstructed knees, man. You know, how they're going to really hold up? You know what I mean? You know?
Let's go, man. All right, let's go. Let's get it popping, y'all. Stop playing. All right, so we're waiting on the first match, man. Schofield kid looking good, man. He like he about to he about to KO this kid. The Schofield kid can knock knock Guerrero out, man. Mm. 
Guerrero's hurt, bro. He's getting hurt. All right, here we are, baby. We're trying to get it right. So we waiting, we waiting, we still waiting, people. Third round.
All right, y'all. What's up? What's up? What's good? What's going on? Welcome to the war zone, baby. Oh, yeah. Where my people at? Knocked down for Schofield. All right, man. We still waiting, man. It's eight o'clock, bro. This kid Schofield can box, man. Oh, uh, he killing this kid right now. He's trying to knock this kid out. He's trying to knock this kid out. Oh, there it is. There it is. Got him. Dropped him. Yeah, that kid's that kid's out of there, bro. Pfft. 
plus seven, huh? <laughs> Tatar said plus seven. Oh my god. They need to stop this fight, bro. He about to get KO'd, man. Yeah, he's hurt, bro. This guy about to get knocked out, bro. Yeah, he's hurt. He's hurt, bro. He's hurt. All right, Myra Brano Swivel making her way to the ring. Man, this guy. Bueno Silva right now getting ready to enter the ring. Oh, Tatara said, Tatara says, uh, it's 3 a.m. here. Wow. Sometimes I take a sleep for a few hours, then I wake up trying to continue the events. Yeah, man. I know that's tough, man, if it's 3 a.m., bro. We starting right now, man. We got the... Uh, Myro Bueno Silva's in the ring. So here we go, bro. 30 years old for Myra Bueno Silva. She's 5'6". Uh, 33 years old for Stephanie Edgar. 
Uh, Edgar has a one and a half inch reach advantage. So here we go with the first fight. The fight is over. They stopped that Schofield fight. Stephanie Edgar. Eight and two out of Orlandia, Brazil. Myra Bueno Silva. Uh oh, Silva's looking to get this right. Bueno Silva, I remember her. She's got uh she's got a little power with her, man. So we're gonna see what Edgar has. Jatara says, I will try, lol. <laughs> Yeah, man. I hey, I don't blame you if you can't make it, bro. Sean Spencer in the house. He's here. All right, we're in the first round, baby. Salute to Sean Spencer. Oh, leg kicks from both of the girls. Another leg kick from Brandon Silva. Ah, oh, another leg kick. Oh, nice front kick, Lance. Oh, takedown for Edgar. Takedown for Edgar. She got the takedown. Oh, Edgar. Big elbows. Big shots from Stephanie Edgar right now. Big hammer fist from Edgar. Big elbows. Uh-oh, she's got the arm bar. Oh, she says she tapped, man. Bueno Silva said that uh, she tapped, but they're checking to see if she tapped because Edgar, they didn't see the tap. They didn't see the tap. Oh, they saw a tap. The judge judge saw the tap. So Bueno Silva wins by um she wins by um wow, that was weird. Sarah Egger tap. 
Wow. They, it was on the other side, Scotty. Scotty boy, yeah, it was on the other side. The judges saw it. Wow. Sean Spencer said beautiful. Wow, that's over that quick, bro. Wow. Damn, man. Jeez, bro. I'm already starting off crappy. Oh, she's crying. Well, that's the end of that one, guys. Derek Bailey is in the house, man. Sean Spencer said, yeah, Derek Bailey is in the house, guys. Yo, salute, salute to Derek, man, Scotty and Sean, man. This is one of my guys I was telling you guys about uh, yesterday, man. It's one of my guys, bro. Yo, Derek, um, yeah, man, we was in here yesterday on PFL, man, and, uh, man, we had a ball, man, but uh, I had to tell him about my people, man. I was like, you know, you guys weren't there yesterday. I said, uh, you know, you find, these guys will finally get to meet you, meet, you know, holler at you, you know. Um, salute to, to Tara, Derek. Yeah. Uh, no, this was the first fight, Derek. Uh, Bueno Silva won by sub in the first round. Um, it was controversial because Sarah Egger, um, 
the tap was you couldn't see it, but the judges saw the tap. And um, so that fight ended, man. So we're on to this. We're on to the next one. Salute this Tara um, Spencer. That's a fake ass cry. Good thing she's a fighter, not an actor. <laughs> Super nut job. Yeah, she is. She is, Sean. <laughs> she needs some serious mental help. <laughs> Sean Spencer said, "Welcome, Derek." Yeah, Derek. Derek's been with us, man, from day one, bro. Yeah, PFL had had it was it was pretty it was pretty decent, man. Oh, you had silver by decision, okay, Derek. Yeah, I screwed up, Derek. As usual, I go and switch at the last minute and pick Edgar. Edgar was winning the fight, man. She got caught up in an armbar, man. She took her down. It was was. Beating her up, man, and then got submitted by Armbar. I'm like, oh man. Edgar was on her way, bro, but she just couldn't get to the finish line, bro. Salute, guys. Yeah, Tatara saying salute. Uh Derek saying on uh, salute to Sean Spencer. Uh salute guys. Have a good one. Yeah, we got um we got um Scotty Boy in here too. RKH was in here too. Now nah, we got. Where are the boys at, man? Where, where, where's our boy? Y'all see at man. So we on to the next one, guys. All right, so we got McKinnon Granger up next. I had to take Granger. I had to take Granger, bro. And it sucks because I know McKenna's going to beat her, man. Uh, Chicago, Chicago got a little baby girl. That is so awesome. Oh, man, that's a blessing, man. Babies are such a blessing, bro. He training with, he, he pulling weights while he's pushing the stroller. <laughs> he pulling weights while he's on the stroller, bro. Oh, yeah, Derek, they've canceled two fights, man. Keenlon, Jason Witt. Fight cancel and um they, they canceled another one man um let me show you let me see let me make sh I'm gonna tell you exactly who they canceled man so they canceled the Jason Witt um Keenlon fight and they f uh the Cochiara and uh, Ariana Lipsky fight so women's fight was canceled and uh Keenlon and Keenlon was my key guy man he's this was his debut this guy's undefeated man i needed him in my lineup man so i just switched my lineups man my lineups are crap now without him man because this kid i had this kid winning by first round knockout man that's how good this kid is man this ken Lon kid is a problem man and they took him off man yeah two fights man yeah, okay. Yeah, Sean. They might put it on next week's card, man. That'll be great. Cause I, I'm I'm taking that kid King Lon, man. He's uh 
too bad Hill's gonna sleep. Yeah, gonna sleep uh uh Tiago tonight. I don't think Tiago got it, man. I don't think he's got it left in him, man. Tough guy. Hill's gonna be you have to be really, really smart in that fight and not get caught with that power, Tiago. But I think Hill's just better fighter, man. Yeah, two fights, Derek. No, nah, Hill's not going to be standing there like that, man. Yeah, Hill has an awesome fight IQ, man. I mean, Hill has, has the potential to be the champ, man. Shoot, man. Uh, Derek said, I need all the points I can get. Well, shoot, Derek. You, you, you're, not in bad, you're, you're not in bad shape at all, bro. Sean Spencer's got Granger by decision next. Yeah, okay. I took Corey McKenna, man, but I, I did I did take Granger on DraftKings because I had to, but uh yeah, I don't know. I just think uh McKenna is just I think she's a better she throws more volume. Um than and her her grappling game is better than Granger. So I had I had I mean McKenna uh I had to go with McKenna, man, to win a decision here. But Granger is is tough and good. I mean, she's she's decent, was what I'm saying. You know, she's decent. Yeah, they suck. Yeah, it, it really is a toss up, man. Yeah, I just think Kenna's just the uh, McKenna is the by a nose the better fighter. But hey. We never know, man. I've seen strange things happen. That's the thing about USC, man. Any given day, just like football. By the way, football season is almost here, man. I watched that Hall of Fame game against um, the Jaguars and the um, Raiders, man. Raiders kicked their behinds. But the Raiders going to be all right, man. We got Derek Carr and... and, and um, and uh from green bay uh, uh 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 you know what i'm talking about man the receiver man they've they were uh they were together in college actually uh, yeah yeah that wasn't a game derek man that was A Brady and Rogers guy. Okay, yep. I got you. Yeah. Yeah, Brady. Brady's definitely the GOAT, man. He's definitely the GOAT, man. This guy, I mean, dude, how do you win that many championships in the in your in an NFL career, bro? It's just unheard of, bro. Unheard of, bro. And I don't think anybody's gonna ever do that. I don't think anybody's ever gonna gonna do that, bro. And I, I, I attribute that to Bill Pelichick's man, brain, bro. Bill Pelichick, you had the best quarterback and coach. I'm saying what I mean is is that, um, I mean, as far as athletically, no. I mean, but just um, being able to buy into a system, man, and to just be a sound quarterback, man, uh, you know, for your in career. Yeah, right, Derek. Especially this day and age, man. Yeah, it's not it's not gonna happen, bro. It's not gonna happen. That's just never gonna be broken, bro. We're gonna we're gonna it's gonna have to be it's gonna have to be a, a superhuman person, man, to be able to do what Brady did, man. <laughs> In this day and age with all the athleticism and how the game has changed and 
because they've taken a lot of elements away from um, the game now, man. So it, it, it's definitely harder. Um, you know, like special teams, you know, you don't get returns anymore. I mean, come on, man. Returns won Super Bowls, man, with Green Bay and, and, and you know what I'm saying? Um, special teams have won Super Bowls, bro. And they just taking that away from, from these guys, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I'm telling you, man. Yeah, man, I'm telling you, bro. Yep, Devontae Adams, man, that's who I was thinking about. I don't know why I didn't couldn't think of him. Shoot, man, Devontae Adams, like, best receiver in the league, bro. I don't know why Green Bay let him go, but I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, 10 inch reach advantage, bro. That's crazy. 10 inch reach advantage, man. Yep. And she's got a four inch height advantage, man. McKinney's McKinney's coming out the grapple, bro. She she can't be I don't think she's gonna stand and, and bang with um Granger. But I took uh Granger. Yeah, four inch height as well. Yeah, I took Granger on my uh took Granger on I had to take her in my lineups. <clears throat> I took her in one of my lineups. Yeah. I'm already screwed with Sarah Egger. God, one, two, three. So I got three, three losses already, man. Wow. Corey McKenna is just uh oh, Corey Poppins McKenna against. Miranda, Danger, Granger, Danger, Granger. Remember, Stranger, Danger. <laughs> remember, they was telling, y'all remember when they was telling the kids, yeah, no way Granger should lose. But then again, this woman in MMA, who knows, right, Scotty? Yo, it, remember that? They used to tell your kids, say, Stranger, Danger, whenever they see the stranger. <laughs> And start running. <laughs> oh my God. I'll tell you people with something else, but they come up with all kinds of stuff, bro. It's stranger danger. And then, then the kids, they tell them, run. <laughs> Sean's business. Yo, she do. 
Yo, Sean Smith sir, said, Granger look like she needs another hit. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, she might. She, yo, she might get hit. She might get hit and a, and a crack pipe fall out of her, out of her, out of her uh, shorts in the ring. <laughs> you know how people's mouthpiece fall out? No, she get hit in the crack pipe, fall out right in the middle of the ring, man. And then she steps on it. Crack. Ref pick it up, put it, ref pick it up and put it in his pocket. He's like, yo, I'm going to hit this later on. <laughs> yo, that's crazy, bro. She said, I need me a, a hit. She said she needs to win. Her meth dealer ain't getting paid. <laughs> yeah, bro. She looking crazy in there, man, Sean. Hey, Derek. Derek, did you see? You, man, you missed, you missed the best card of the year, bro. You missed the best card of the year, Derek. The Contender Series, man, last Tuesday. This Tuesday. Oh, my God, bro. Bro. Best card I've seen, bro. First time the Contender Series trended worldwide, man, in UFC history, bro. Like, yo, all five fighters got contracts, man. You had four knockouts, and, and, and I mean, it, there was some knockdowns, drag outs. Yo, guys was getting knocked, knocking each other down, bro, getting up, knocking each other out. I was like, what is going on here, bro? Oh, my God. I'll be back here Tuesday, man. We should have another good one, but nothing's going to top that one, bro. Sean said he's regretting having to take Miranda meth head. M Miranda might come out here, man. All right, here we go. Pancratia fighter, seven and two out of Everett, Washington, plus 160 underdog. Miranda Danger Granger. We got a little baby. Minus 190 favorite. Fighting out of Wales. All right, Keith Peterson in there. Here we go, first round. Yeah, her deal is going to be hunting her down, bro. She ain't even going to return back home all right here we go first round mckinney mckenna already closing the distance landing a jab nice little overhand right from mckenna Inside leg kick, outside leg kick from uh, Granger. She, oh, nice. Corey McKenna piecing her up. A nice outside leg kick for a Granger. McKenna, uh, her hands are definitely faster than Granger's. She landed a little. Nice one, too, from uh, McKenna. Oh. All right. They're getting into a little grapple. Uh-oh. Double underhooks for um, 
Double Underhooks from, from McKenna. She got a single. Uh-oh, she better watch that guillotine. Uh-oh, she's got a guillotine going. She's trying to. Oh, take down. Take down for McKenna. Take down again. McKenna's strong. Take down for McKenna. Yeah, she, yeah. He said, come on, Karen, the crackhead. <laughs> <sighs> I'm not, but she'll put it with yeah. Getting pieced up has a 10 inch reach advantage. Yeah, Granger does suck, bro. McKinney's on top right now. Landing some shots to the side of the big shots to the side of the face from McKenna. Right to the ear, bro. Right to the ear, and she just standing there, letting her just bang her in the face. More shots to the side of the face. Rib shots, more shots to the side of the head for McKenna. More shots. McKenna can't even stop her from punching her in the face, bro. I mean, uh, Granger, elbows. She just holding on for dear life right now, bro. Holding on for dear life. She got this, she got this beanstalk on her back, bro. Beating her up. Uh oh, full mountain. Nice side control now. Elbows to the stomach, inside control. Oh, she's. Oh, she's trying to get that uh, head and arm choke. There's only seconds left, though. Six seconds left. Oh, sub attempt at the end, head and arm choke. God, man, Mc Granger looked like a straight up. She looked like, yo, she she's on something, bro. She on something, bro. Yo, she looked she looked malnutrition like crazy, bro. God, look at this. 33 to 4 in total strikes, bro. Yeah. Granger burned a lot of injury trying to get up and out of that choke. Yup. And watch Granger try to come out wild and get this round back and get and get taken down again. That's what usually happens. Watch. She's gonna come out, try to come forward and 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 try to get some get back in this round and get taken down again and dominate it. Oh, double nice hook coming in from 
McKenna. Uh oh, she about to take her down again. Uh oh, she got it. She got it. Um, oh, it's on the wrong side. Takes her down again. Nice job. Takes her down again. This girl ain't got nothing. Granger ain't got nothing. Man. I just, I just don't want her to get finished. I need her to. She ain't scored nothing though, man. So it doesn't even matter, bro. Oh, she tapped the Von Fluke choke. McKenna stops her in the first round, bro. God. She put that Von Fluke choke on her, man. God, man. All right, Kenna. I'll take the tapology win. That was the thing. She's just too strong for Granger, bro. Look at that. Submission. Yeah, she sucks bad, bro. I had to go with McKenna, bro. Because of her grappling, bro. You pick uh, McKenna by KO second round. Okay. So, Derek, you get 65 points out of that. What the hell did I just watch, Scotty Boy said? You just watched the... You just watched the meth addict get beat up, man. Granger looked it crazy, man. All that hype, man, and you couldn't even... You couldn't even keep that girl at bay with a jab and no takedown defense? Oh, come on, man. That's what I say about the UFC, man. You don't know what you're going to get, man. You know, either it's a Mitch match or it's just two bums and, you know, just trying to get a check, man. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, Corey McK McKenna was just way better than her, man. And because I noticed that the ref the, the records really don't reflect, man, these, these uh, people, man. And and you can really, really rely on the one who fought the better competition, you know, and just uh, who's a better all-around fighter, you know what I mean? And you know the ones that are in there for a check, like Granger. And, you know, granted, neither one of these girls will ever be a champion, ever. You just, you know the ones who really want to be champions, man, because they get better. Corey, Mary, Corey, Mary Poppins, Mary Poppins just beat up um, Crackhead Karen. This girl is strong and she ain't even breathing. She's just giving her interview like she didn't even fight, bro. Look at this girl, man. I mean, she's not huffing and puffing at all, bro. She's in shape. Great job with Uriah Faber over there, man. Great job getting your having your, your fighters ready, man. Have their cardio together, man. This girl ain't breathing hard at all, bro. Oh man, we got a good one. We got we got Brian Battle up next, man. Contender series last season's uh what the way champ, man.
He said, a 10-inch reach advantage. Oh, God. Favor makes sure they're all well prepared. Yes, he does, man, Derek. Yes, he does. He know what it is, man. Former champ. All right, Corey. Corey came in ready. Oh, we got Brian Battle against Sato, man. Wow. And the thing about it, man, this kid's got this kid's got the potential to be to be light heavyweight champ, man. Jamal Hill, he really does, man. He really does. He really does, man. He kind of reminds me of a, you know, he's never, he's not a John Jones, but he's, he, he, the kid, the kid, the kid is nice, man, with his hands, man, and his reach. He knows how to use his range. I expect him to be able to keep his range with them. Um, and he's got crazy knees, crazy knees, this kid, man. That Muay Thai clinch he puts on these opponents. He got big hands, bro. Big hands. Oh, that Johnny Walker KO was crazy. I mean, he put him to sleep on his feet, bro. He was out. I mean, gasping for breath, man. He was dead. He killed him. They resuscitated Johnny Walker. And Johnny Walker started off so good. I said, this guy's going to be a problem, man. I said, man, John Jones and the rest of these guys, man, you got to be careful with this kid, Johnny Walker. And Johnny Walker started getting slept, bro. I think he's been slept three or four times. I said, oh, my God. And Jamal Hill's not, he's not one of the biggest light heavyweights, man. He's just, the kid's got hands, man, and power. And I know Tiago, Tiago will go to sleep too, man. You catch him the right way. He's tough, though. The way he beat St. Prue, oh, yeah, knocked him out on his feet. Oh, that was ugly what he did to uh what he did to um Johnny Walker, man. Yeah, he's not big at all, man. He's not he's not he's not a big when he gets in there, he doesn't he he's just a slim kid with power. He reminds me of John Jones. John Jones is a little bigger up top though, but um this kid reminds me, he reminds me of that type of John Jones type of style, you know. You know, we all know we ain't gonna never see nothing like John Jones again, but geez. This kid's a problem. Six point twenty six point two significant strikes per minute, one point nine three knockdowns in fifteen minutes of fights. Oh, come on, man. He said he was calling for John Jones. Man, boy, you, you was calling for the wrong one.
you probably give John a good fight, but John's just too well rounded. John will take him down, bro. If John feel like he he's he he's he's giving them problems on the feet, John will take you down, bro, and submit you, bro. <laughs> John was a different animal, man. He's just he's the goat, bro. He's just a different animal, bro. Yeah, I've seen John in some battles, man. He's been in some battles, man. Really close fights, man. Wow. Look at that head movement, this kid, how he set up this right hand, man. Boom! Right on the temple. He killed Johnny Walker in that ring, bro. Johnny Walker was dead. He was dead for about three minutes. Yeah, Derek said facts. Yeah, I, I would never say that he's he was he was be he would be ready for somebody the likes of a John Jones. He's got to get past Prohaska, man, the champ right now, man. And um, I think he'd have problems with Glover Teixeira too, man. If he doesn't knock Glover out, man, Glover will take him down and submit him too, man. I just think he just needs a little bit more time, man, and he'll he he can win that champ. He could, he could beat. He, he could definitely beat a Prohaska, man. I believe he can. I mean, it goes Sato, 16 and 5. See, this is where you got to be careful. Brian Battle is, um, he's 8 and 1, and Sato is 16 and 5. You got to be careful of these guys with records like Sato, man. Um, he's a veteran. He's been there. Um, Brian Battle is is not a, 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 I mean, he just doesn't show me the, the full package at this point, man. Um, he's solid, but he's, he's young, he's new. And, you know, I, I just want to see where his, where his cardio really is. I know he's got big heart, man. That's one thing about Brian battle. He's got heart and he fights to the last second, bro. But, uh, when you know you got guys like Sato with the experience that they have, I want to see how well Brian Battle does against them. Definitely has the height and reach advantage, man. He's got a four inch reach advantage, uh, two inch height advantage, and um, he lands seven significant strikes per minute. And he's a decent grappler, he's definitely a better grappler than Sato, but like I said, um. I just want to see how he does with a with a with a UFC veteran like Sato, which and 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 Sato's not uh, anyone to be, you know, uh, a big threat. You know what I mean? But I just want to see how the um, young kid does against him. You know, this would be a statement fight for him, I believe, man. If he can go out there and stop this Sato, man, I mean, you know, I think it'll be uh, great for him, man. Yeah, I took battle too. Derek. Yeah, Sato has been getting handled, man. I still I just want to see how Battle does with him, man. Uh if Battle 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 can finish him. He can definitely finish him, man. And he probably will. You know what I'm saying? He probably will finish him, man. I just I just you know uh you know, if he struggles with Sato, that's that's what I'm looking for, man. You know, I, I don't expect him to, but if he does, it's going to show me something else about battle. You know what I mean? And But like I said, I don't expect him to, man. I expect him to go out there and get it done. Go out there and handle your bending, man. They always talking about forever faithful. 
talking about the 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 armed forces, man, and the Marines or whatever. And I'm saying, man, you guys need to stop, man. The way you be treating veterans, bro. Get that part of it right, man. Get that part right first before you go saying talking big on the on the military, man. You know, I know a lot of some guys the military has treated treated fine, but come on, man. Treat these veterans right, bro. Come on, man. You got people going overseas fighting for stuff that they don't even they may not necessarily agree with and risking their lives for it. And they come home and then you just crap all over them. I hate that, bro. I hate it, man. I know several veterans, man, who are just getting treated like crap, bro. And they and and you think about it. What 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 greater occupation is that, man? Is there, man, for some someone really like go to these wars, not even knowing if they're going to come home, they're risking their lives, bro. Got somebody else on the end of a gun looking to kill you so that they they don't get killed. And it should be priority for people like that, bro. Yeah, all propaganda, uh, Derek. Yeah, man, that, it pisses me off, man. It pisses me off, man. And I've, I'm not even a veteran, bro. Like, I've never... Join the military, man. I went to school, played football, but still, man, come on, man. What what greater occupation is there, bro? Greater occupation, bro. Come on, man. I mean, even a police officer's job is safer than than a a a a a a military guy man yeah come home and get straight disrespected derek absolutely man straight disrespected bro can't even get no health care bro like come on man and then you got I, i'm surprised that people are still signing up for the military This goes to show how 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 slow so many people are, man. How slow people are, bro. Why don't you just go on and be a cop, man? Why you gotta what what's what what's so big about the military, bro? Be a fireman, be a cop. I don't know, man. It's just, I'm telling you, it's just backwards, bro. Yeah, don't tell a cop that. Yeah. Right, Derek. <clears throat> yeah, huh? He said, don't tell a cop that. But they're they're quick to say thank you for your services. Thank you for your service. Yeah, but thank them thank them by taking care of them, man. Thank them by taking care of them. Don't don't thank them with your mouth, man. Juliana Miller and and Brogan Walker, that's gonna be a heck of a fight, man. Experience wise, Brogan's got the experience. Juliana's just a dog, man. Juliana's a dog. She's got that. She got that. She's got that. She's got some BJJ going with her, and she just comes straight forward, man. Taller. Mm, yeah. Thank you for your service. Thank you for your service. Yeah, but then they say, you know, we ain't, we thank you for your service, but we ain't going to give you nothing. <laughs> we ain't going to look out for you. You heard what Trump said about him? Oh, my God. Yo, he's talking about POWs. He was like, yeah, 
I don't respect POWs. They shouldn't have got caught. Oh my God, yo. Yo, I ain't never heard something. I ain't heard nothing so crazy in my life, bro. Never heard nothing so crazy in my life, bro. He said I, he didn't respect um what's his name? Um the the uh guy who um John um you know what I'm talking about the guy who ran who's running for president. Uh, uh um you know what I'm talking about. Right, Derek. Yeah, don't thank me. Give me something, Mike. <laughs> yeah, Derek, there it is. Yeah, you remember when you remember when that idiot said that? You remember that? Oh my God! Yeah, yeah, yeah. John McCain. John McCain, man. Yeah, bro. Yo, he was like, I don't respect. I don't respect guys that get caught. I said, what? Are you kidding me? As if that isn't a part of war, man. POWs, I mean, when is that not a part of war? Oh, my God, bro. I, 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 I was blown away by that, man. I said, this guy is really, really, he's slow, bro. Yeah, John McCain, man. How could you say that to Americans? Americans actually like you after that, bro. If they, if they, if they value the service of our soldiers and veterans, bro, fighting, you know. Oh my God, I, I, I they, it, it was just idiotic, bro. I've never heard anything like it. Never heard anything like it, man. To this day, I'm still just like blown away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he was shot down, right? Yeah, right. Don't you know, man, that anybody can get 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 become a prisoner of war, bro? Anybody, man. He was tortured and everything, man. McCain was, bro. You could just imagine what they were doing to him, man. You never know, man. It could have been they could have been having they could have had the guy eating crap, all kind of stuff, man. You just don't know, man. And and to survive that and make it home, man. Thank God for that, bro. But for you to say that, bro, I, I and you running for president, or I don't know if he was president at that time, but I know he was running. And you got a whole, he had a whole fleet of veterans voting for him, bro. After them hearing that, <laughs> I'm like, what? Yo, people in the United States are slow, bro. I'm telling you, man. People are slow, man. People are slow, bro. They're deceived. People are deceived, man. And it's sad, but it is what it is. I mean, that's anywhere, but I'm just, I'm speaking on the U.S., man. Got them everywhere, man. Brian Battle is walking into the cage. Oh, he's in shape. Brian Battle's in shape. He got that flab off of him, bro. I was hoping this. I said, let me see if Brian's going to come in. Brian coming in slim, bro. Yo, his cardio might be intact, bro. I took Battle anyway. Brian's tough too, and he got a chin. Brian Pooh Bear Battle. Somebody told him. Right. See, Derek? Yeah, because some of the training we had came from the stuff they did to POWs in Vietnam. 
Absolutely. Absolutely. I was going to mention that, man. All right, here we go, man. Prime battle. Takashi Sato. Out of Tokyo, Japan. Plus 250 underdog. Takashi. Eight and one. Brian Battle is in shape. He used to have a flabby stomach, bro. He used to be flabby, bro. He's, yo, he's straight rip right now. I'm like, all right, Brian. Brian got rid of that excess weight, man. So that means he's, he's got his cardio got to be right, man. Eight And then I'm saying these are welterweights. Just imagine Usman. Imagine Brian Battle trying to fight Usman, man. Oh, my God. Usman would destroy him right now. All right, here we go. First round. Another thing Battle got to do is he got to make sure he moves his head. High kick, front kick from battle. That's what you got to do. Keep your, keep your distance. Nice body shot from Sato. Front kick from Brian. Nice inside leg kick from Brian. Oh, it's over. Brian battle KOs him with a head kick. Oh, my God, that was ugly. He killed him, guys. He's dead. He's dead, bro. They killed him. He's out. I mean, out cold. Eyes closed the whole nine, bro. Oh, my God, that head kick was crazy, bro. You looked amazing. He said, I told y'all I got better. Boom. <laughs> chin on chin, bro. <clears throat> Boom. Poor Sato, man. Oh, that was ugly. That was perfect. He said, I told y'all I got better, baby. He looked better, man. I said, Brian Battle looks amazing, bro. He used to be flabby. He had this little belly on him. He came into this fight ready, bro. Yeah, man. He was casket ready for that, bro. You see the way he had his arms folded? Oh, my God, that was ugly. I would say this next fight is going to be a finish, but Sam Alvey's tough. But Ola Sechuk, man, he 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 he's he's one of the biggest favorites on this card, bro. Wow, man. Well, let's say Chuck. I played it pretty safe this week, man. I, I didn't take, I only took one, two, two KOs out of this whole card, bro. Two KOs out of this whole card. 
I don't know why I played it safe like that, man. You gotta you gotta go for it. Still getting 50, 50 points. Look at Sato. Sato's Yo, Brian's camp did an amazing job by getting him ready for this, bro. <laughs> I like that, Brian. Brian said he put ten dollars in the slot machine and got seventy five and quit. Yeah, Brian. He said that just translated. Yeah, I wish I picked the KO two, Derek. Man, what my guys at in the chat, man? Sean and and and, and Scotty. Would you who'd you guys pick in this one, man? Tatara, my boy Tatara might be asleep. Now Santo has to take that long flight back He wants in Gary. Oh. Oh, he calling him out. I like. I like the way battle is did Brian call out Brian Barbarina and Ian Gary. He said, I don't like you spell the way you spell your name. You spell your name wrong, dude. Then the kick, yes. Good job, Brian Battle. Brian Battle came out and Dana Weiss right now is licking his chops over that, over that, bro. He's like, I got it right. Because he was the welterweight champ of uh he won the uh he won the he won the no no he was a middleweight he was a middleweight and he went down to welterweight that's why he's so slim I just thought about that I just thought about that he was the middleweight champ That's why he's so in shape, bro. Yeah, he was middleweight, bro. Wow. That's a killer division, though, Brian, man. I don't think he's ready for them welters, man. There's some killers at welterweight, bro. Usman's fighting against Zach Puaga, man. Oh, man. I don't like the way Usman drops his head when he throws punches, man. I think he's good. I mean, I mean, he's got that power and that and 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 he throws hard, but Zach is just way more technical. He's got um he's got grappling too, but he can't make the mistake and grapple too early and then gas and get caught by Usman, man. That, that's, that's a tough fight, man. And Zach is a light heavyweight. He's not even a full heavyweight. So if Zach, if Zach wins this, he is not going to fight at heavyweight in the UFC. He'll fight at light heavyweight. But uh, that's a tough fight, man. But I think Zach is just better with his hands. Um, but like I said, Usman can knock him out. 
and vice versa. If Usman starts to slow down later in the rounds, man, I think Zach is going to have an advantage, man. If his if his cardio stands up, so we'll see. But I I I've seen Zach Poirier um slow down too, man. So we'll see. So for me, that's a pick 'em fight, man. I I did take Poirier because of his well-rounded all-around game, but I switched up on DraftKings and uh, took Usman and Usman because I had to. I had to take Usman. We'll see, man. I want Usman to win, but tall task, bro. He's going to have to be on his A game. But Usman's been been around the he's been around different leagues, man, fighting. So he reminds me of an Ingano, man. Like he's an Ingano type of fighter, man. Like he's got his brother, Kamar Usman, the best pound for pound fighter in the world right now. Leon Edwards is in for a big, big problem, bro. Yeah, that's that's Usman's brother. Yep. Yeah, that's that's Usman's um. That's his brother, man. Yeah, Muhammad. That's his brother. Oh, you didn't know that, Derek? Okay. Yeah, he's just gonna have to pace himself. Usman paces himself, and he can't he can't let Zach uh, beat him to the punch, you know. Because Usman, I notice he he tries to be really really patient, man, and and you can out out punch out out uh, land him, you know what I mean? So, you know, he can't be in there just looking for a big shot, man. You went with Oleg, yeah, I went with Oleg too, man. I went with Oleg. Zach Poaga, he 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 trains with Curtis Blades, bro. Wow, I'm gonna see if he's gonna come at Usman. Usman better get that uppercut ready. Wow. Oh, let's say Chuck. Sam Alvey's Sam Alvey's a vet, man. Sam Alvey, he, he ain't no pushover. Oh, let's say Chuck. I've seen Ola Say Chuck, man, gas out, man. So I'm 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 anxious to see what type of shape he's gonna come in, man, because oh Damn, I know I'm doing terrible on DraftKings right now, man. I just know it, man. Let me check, man. I know I am. I already know I am. Well, I'm winning on one. I'm winning on one, man. Only one. God, man. I lost two fights and I'm still winning money, bro. I got Terrence McKinney, Jeff Neal, and Jamal Hill. Jeff Neal's going to lose to Luke, man. I'm going to need him to get a lucky knockout. 
Wow. All I needed was somebody to win, bro. Or last the distance, man. It, both of the my two fighters lost by submission, man. Damn, I'm still winning money, man. That's weird. Sato is right now, he crying, bro, on his way back to Japan. Oh, oh, he stiffened them up too, man. Stiffened them up, bro. Look at his hands, man. He had his hands still in the guard, bro. Caught him with the punch, like Derek said, and the kick. The ref saw that right away. The ref said, leave him alone. Don't hit him again. He said, <laughs> he, yo, yo, the commentator said something like hitting a watermelon with a baseball bat. <laughs> oh, my God. That's bad, bro. Wow, Derek, man. Where's our guys at, man? I don't see skinny in here. I don't see. Oh, man. Y'all see his missing. He probably watching boxing. Probably uh checking out boxing, man. Let me just check over here and see what's going on with boxing, man. Cito Barrero. Yo, I like this kid, this Schofield kid, man. I, oh, man, that kid looks good, bro. Hank Lundy came out there, came out, knocked the kid down, bro. And then went on to lose the rest of the fight, bro. I said, oh, man, good job. Jeez, man, I screwed up, man. All right, let's go. All right.
All right. What we got here? Still waiting, man. All right, let's checking out that uh wow pre fight pre fight we're still waiting, man. We still waiting, man. We still waiting. Yeah, Derek, man. I, I don't know how I how I missed um having not having this Virgil Ortiz uh fight on our topology, man. I, I dropped the ball on that one, man. I meant to have that one on there, man. I must have missed it. Cause you got I gotta go through the list and I definitely missed it, man. But I wanted that card on there and I didn't it's 11 fights, 10 or 11 fights on that card, man. And I I missed it. I thought I had it, but I obviously I didn't. Yeah, obviously I didn't have it. Ortiz gonna knock that boy out though, man. It ain't even. So we got Alvin and Oli Sechuk about to make their ring walks. The zone. I don't even know why they even showing the 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 the, the, the man. I don't know. Nobody want to see no Triple G and and Canelo again, bro. Like, God, you guys, man, you guys making that seem like it's the biggest bot uh, fight in boxing. It sucks, bro. All right, we got walkouts, man. These guys are about to walk out. I'm about to grab me something to drink real quick. I'll be right back, guys.
Ola Chaychuk looking slim. Ola Chaychuk is looking a little slimmer than I usually see him, bro. He might be in shape. Jack said, yeah, I was wondering about that. I don't understand how they are selling Canelo Triple G either. Canelo has rabid fans that want to see that BS, though. Yeah, that's all that is, bro. They think he's... Them people look at him as like, like God, bro. Smiling. Sam Alvey. All right, Alvey. We're going to see if you're going to be smiling. Sam Alvey, wife, look like she in her 50s, man. Yeah, this is the slimmest I ever seen Ola Say Chuck, man. He come in there. He be coming in there flabby. First round. He got to watch Sam Alvey's. Uh, oh, he he tried to take Sam Alvey's head off already. Nice shots. Oh, Sam Alvey swinging back. Oh, say check got to be careful, man. Nice shots coming in from Ola Sechuk, but he can't be reckless, man, because Sam will catch him with something in between, bro. Oh, he knocked Sam Alvey down. Big, big ground and pound. Big elbows. Oh, he got him in a cru crucifix right now. Oh, he split open too, Alvy. Alvy's getting crushed, bro. Big shots coming in. Oh, let's say Chuck. Oh, this might be it for Alvy. Oh, Alvy's hurt. He's hurt. Ola Sechak trying to catch him. Dropped him again. That's it. It's over. Wow. I don't know how he's still in the UFC, Derek, man. That's what I say, man. Knockout. First round knockout for Ola Sechuk. Wow. Ugly. Wow. Wow. Wow, bro. That was ugly. Wow, I still got one, see, one, two, three, four, five, six. I still got, I got, I got six. Oh, shoot. I got six. You, I got six, uh, what you call us, with five fighters remaining, bro. Wow, I'm bugging, man. Good. I'm good on on uh, DraftKings. I wasn't paying attention, man. So I'm yeah, KO, bro. You pick KO round two, Derek. You good, man.
Derek said, I didn't pick a KO. Oh, you did pick KO round two. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I didn't pick KO either, man. I picked decision, man. I, like I said, I only took two KOs in this whole card, man. It always happens that way, bro. Sam Valvey's mustache went from went from 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 uh, orange to red, bro. Yeah, he came in shape. I can tell the way he was swinging. I said, yeah, he in shape, man. He trying to finish this man. Sam got beat up in front of his wife and six kids, man, in the audience, bro. That's the worst, man. That's the worst, man. I don't never want to get beat up in front of my wife, man. I'll be like, stay at home. Don't watch it. <laughs> Oh man, that was a straight left too that dropped him. Damn, Sam, how you get that? Sam just in there for a check, man. That's what I say, man. And these guys. See, when you chase money, man, that's why bad things happen to you, man. When you're just chasing money, man. Kind of remind me of, like, Anderson Silva, Muhammad Ali's career. Because Muhammad Ali fought way past when he should have been fighting, man. But um, I was watching this Larry Holmes um, documentary or, or interview. Larry Holmes was like, Muhammad just wouldn't turn down that money. He kept telling Muhammad Ali, he kept telling... Muhammad Ali, don't fight that man, man. Stop fighting, bro. But Muhammad Ali was like, shut up, boy. You don't tell me what to do. And look what happened, man, to Muhammad later on in his career, man. He just, I was like, go out on top, bro. Yeah, that's why he's still in the UFC. <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, man. Larry Holmes kept telling, he was like, Mama Ali, come on. He said he did the same thing, but, you know, it was a strategic move, man. You know, when he fought, when he fought Mike Tyson, he told Don King, he said, man, I can't beat that man, man. He said, what you, I, I ain't getting in there with no Mike Tyson. And then Don King was like, I give you $10 million. He says, all right. <laughs> he said, all right. He said, that was it for him, man. But he didn't even get to train. He didn't even get a full training camp to uh, train for Mike Tyson, man. Because uh, they told him nine weeks, and then what Don King called him back and said, uh, you only got like 
I think three weeks or something like that. Man, Larry didn't even get to train for Mike Tyson, man. And he was trying to catch him with an uppercut. And the reason why Mike knocked him out was because his arm got caught in the ropes when he was trying to throw an uppercut. And he was wide open and Mike Tyson caught him. Um, um, yeah, man. I was like, what? Yeah, man, that's just crazy, bro. Yeah, man, that's crazy. Yeah. Oh, Derek. Okay, I see you. You say where is Hill from? Uh, uh, Hills from Grand Rapids, Michigan. Yeah, he's he's out of Grand Rapids. I um, I mean that's where he that's where he's his he's originally from. Yeah, yeah, Derek. Ten mil get me out of it. Back then, we're talking back then, bro. Ten mil back then. Oh man, I'd I'd have ran up out of there. I said all I need is two. All I need is three hours, man. If they had to call me in three hours notice, I'd be like, all right. Cause soon as Mike, Mike could punch me in the in the arm and I'm going down. Oh, my shoulder, man. My shoulder out of socket. <laughs> and I wouldn't be lying either, bro. I'd be like, yo. Yeah, yeah, he's out of Grand Rapids, Michigan. Yeah, but I think he's a Chicago kid, man. I think he's a Chicago kid, but he—I think he—he—he—he's in Grand Rapids, Michigan now. If I make no mistake, let me go see Derek to make sure. Um, because they do say Chowtown a lot. Yeah, okay, I got it. He was born in Chi Town, but he lives in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Yeah, they be mentioning Chi Town too. You know how they mention, you know, they'll mention both of them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I, I, I forgot about that. They be mentioning Chi Town with him and Chaos Williams too. Chaos Williams, I think, is out of uh, Chicago. Yep. All right, let me switch this up, man. I got it on the wrong. It's on the wrong thing right now. So we should be close to the. Uh, that's the final prelim. So, oh, this is a fight right here, bro. Jamal Hill, Eric Gonzalez. I mean, uh, Terrence McKinney. My fault. I got Terrence McKinney. This is one of the knockouts. I got Terrence McKinney by second round knockout. But uh, I don't know. We'll see. Might go the distance. I'm hoping Terrence can get him out of there. Scotty Boy said, let's go. Michael, first round KO. I need another KO from McKinney. Me too, Scotty. Me too, bro. I need another one too, man. I need one too, Scotty, bro. Oh, Blair Cobbs and Maurice Hooker. 
Blair Cobb said he gonna he gonna he gonna knock uh Hooker out. He ain't gonna knock no Hooker out, man. You better try to win that fight. Tripping. Tell me what you gonna knock out. You gonna you gonna you gonna beat him up. All right, go in there and beat him up. I want to see you do it. Blair to Flair Cobbs. Oh, Blair Cobbs must be fighting uh, Maurice Hooker right now, man. Man, Blair going to get beat up, man. Watch him. Watch Maurice. Watch Maurice just sit back and just pick him apart. Oh, they're in there right now. All right, Blair trying to get him looks, combinations off. Maurice trying to walk him down. Oh, nice. Big right hand from Blair Cobbs. But he got caught with something. Hooker gonna knock, he gonna knock Blair out, man. He gonna knock Blair Cobbs out, bro. Blair Cobb got some weird footwork, bro. It's like he wants to have footwork, but he's just he, 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 throwing wide punches. Got just got caught by Maurice Hooker. Maurice Hooker gonna knock him out. Watch, he gonna catch him. Blair, Blair ain't got him all, man. I can just tell the way he act, man. He ain't got him all, man. Blair about to get KO'd, bro. Michael McKenzie's in for a big, big problem, bro, with, with, with Virgil Ortiz. Well, Virgil, man, Virgil got dropped, man. He got dropped by what's you call it? All right, Terrence McKinney, man. All right, we still waiting, man. We waiting. All right, Blair Cobb. Maurice Hooker's like, man, I I, I Blair taking these jabs, though. Nice combinations by Blair, though. He, he landing. 
Nice, nice, nice fainting, Blair. But what you gonna do with it? Blair scared of that right hand of Maurice Hooker. Blair swinging all wild, off balance. Say he gonna beat up Maurice Hooker. That's how I know Blair's slow, man, because he's looking crazy awkward in this fight right now, man. <laughs> He ain't he ain't he ain't controlling the fight. All right. Oh. Oh man, he hitting him behind the head. Maurice Hooker hitting Blair behind the head. Maurice trying to walk him down right now. Hooker, Hooker gonna beat him with this jab, bro. I'm watching it, right? I'm just watching. Hey, he said Blair looks like Ice T. He do, man. He look like Ice T. Look at him, man. He look just like Ice T. <laughs> Yo, he in there. I'm a psychopath walking. Uh, man, talking. Oh, nice, nice right hand from Blair Cobb's lands, man. That look like he kind of stunned Maurice, man. Maurice didn't like that. He didn't like that. Blair ain't trying to jump on him, though. Oh, another big right hand fry. Oh, oh man. What's called trying to fight dirty, man? Maurice Hooker trying to fight dirty. Hitting behind the head again. He already been warned about it. Oh, they got some bad blood in the ring here with these two. <laughs> Derek Belly said, Bear looking like ice tea. Look at him over there in the corner. He got Coco in his corner. He got his wife Coco right there. She 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 working on his cut. Nice straight left hand. Oh, nice right hand from Blair Cobb. Yeah. Oh, nice combination from Blair. He got a little mouse under the eye of uh, Hooker. Blair's a little quicker to the punch on, on, on Hooker. He's got to stay away from that jab. He's doing, doing all right this round. All right, we still waiting on Terrence McKinney, man, and uh, Eric Gonzalez, man. Waiting for them to walk out. Because we're in the main card now. You know, it's a little, they always have a little, a little break. Hooker ain't really doing much this round, man. Last couple rounds are pretty close, man. But I, I, I mean... Oh, right behind the head, bro. Caught him behind the head again. Morris Hooker fighting dirty, bro. He trying to land in the back of the head, bro. Spun Blair around and hit him right in the back of the head again, bro. All right, Blair. That's right. Keep it moving, man. Keep moving. Keep moving. Because he ain't quicker than you, man. 
I don't know what Blair thought he thought, thought he could compete with somebody like a Terrence Crawford or a, a man. I put Sean Porter on him right now out of retirement. He knocked he knocked Blair Cobbs out, bro. Oh no! He oh Blair hurt. He hurt Hooker, bro. He hurt Hooker. He hurt Hooker, bro. Yo, he caught her hooker and hurt him, bro. He caught her hooker and hurt him, bro. Blair, all right, Blair. All right, don't start getting caught with that jab again. Blair fighting, bro. Blair fighting right now. Get him, Blair. Get him, Blair. He's way quicker than Maurice Hooker, bro. Way quicker. Now Hooker stepping on his foot. Now Hooker trying to step on his foot. Nice left hand from Blair Cobbs. That's right, Cobbs. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. You're around. You went in the round. This is Blair Cobb caught him and hurt him, bro. Yeah, he been off over. Yeah, 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 yeah. Blair trying to style on him a little bit. All right, we about all right. So uh the main car about to start right now. It's still it's just starting, man. So we got a little we got a few minutes. Wow, okay, Blair Cobb. Let's go, Blair. Blair fighting, man. Boom. Boom. Oh, he caught Maurice right on the chin, bro. Nice little short, short right hook. Oh, that was beautiful. Maurice's eyes swelling up right now. I like what I see from Blair right now, man. He's just quicker. He's quicker than Maurice, man. Maurice got them long arms, long hands. Nice, nice double jab from uh from uh Blair Cobbs, man. He just can't stay stationary and let let Hooker get that jab off. Oh, oh, oh! Big flurry from Blair Cobbs, man. Oh, he gave him like a ten piece, man. He gave he gave Hooker a ten piece, bro. That's right. That's why right, Blair. He headbutted, man. Headbutt. Headbutt by Maurice Hooker, bro. Blair Cobbs pieced him up with like a 10 piece. Boom, 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 boom. They in the uh sixth round, man. And he just headbutted uh Blair Cobbs, man. Gave him a cut over his left eye. But Blair's piecing them. Oh, yeah, they got caught. It was a headbutt, bro. I'm telling you, Maurice, Maurice fighting dirty, man. Hooker fighting dirty. He, he kind of frustrated with Blair Cobbs because you know Blair Cobbs going to talk crap. Now, here come Hooker trying to come forward. Hooker trying to come forward. Blair's movement is Blair got really good movement. He's got really good movement. He's showing he got really good movement. Oh, nice, nice right hook from uh, Blair Cobbs. I'm rooting for Blair right now, bro. I'm rooting for Blair right now. Maurice trying to stalk him now, but Blair moving. Blair moving. Blair moving. That's right, Blair. Just keep moving. Nice jab from Hooker, though. Hooker headhunting again. He headhunting again. But Blair boxing him. Blair boxing him. But Maurice also, he, he's aware. He's trying to close the distance, but he's aware. He know Blair still got that, that big left.
Blair wrapping him up, trying to get his get get his breath. Nice body shot from uh, Hooker. Nice right hand from uh uh oh Hooker trying to get something off on uh, Blair. Oh, nice one two from Blair. Oh, nice jab from uh, Blair. Come on, Blair. Get him, Blair. Another one-two from Blair. Let's go get him, man. Counter punch. Counter punch. Nice body shot from Blair. Boom. Oh, nice counter punching from Blair Cobbs, man. Let's go, Blair, man. Good job, Blair. Oh, I'm liking it, bro. Get him, Blair. Get him. Yeah, we're still waiting, man. Still waiting on UFC, man. I'm just enjoying this little fight, man, between <laughs> yo. Blair styling on Maurice Suka right now, bro. He's... Blair styling on him right now. That's a nice, that's a nice little cut, bro. That's a nice cut, bro. I don't know if Blair gonna slow down though, man. He he. Oh, I, hopefully he can keep up the momentum, man. All right, Maurice stalking. He's stalking Blair right now. He's stalking Blair. Maurice ain't letting his hands go, though, man. He ain't really doing nothing, man. He just fighting to cut the ring off. And Blair just moving, moving in and out. Yeah, Blair Cobb's winning this, winning this fight, man. They got him winning five out of five out of the six rounds. Oh, nice quadruple jab from uh from Blair Cobbs, bro. He was boom, 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 boom. Yeah, Maurice looks terrible, bro. Now he's trying to tackle. He's trying to tackle Blair Cobbs. Nice body shot. From Blair. Blair tried to catch him with a wicked uppercut. Just missed. But Maurice ain't doing nothing, man. Oh, man. Nice double jab again. Snapping the head back of uh, Maurice Hooker, man. All right, Blair, let's go. With his eye all cut. Maurice be trying to close the distance, but when when Blair stands still, he he don't really he don't he can't really do anything. Blair's moving too he's moving too good for him, man. He's moving really well in this ring, man. I'm surprised that he's uh, able to do it this long, man. And he knows how to. He's slipping punches and wrapping them up. All right, Blair, man. I, I, I'm surprised he's showing he's showing some IQ right now, man. Maurice is just missing, man. He's missing, bro. Body shot from Blair Cobbs. Keep trying to get the distance. But Maurice knows his hands are quicker. That's why he ain't really trying to come in all aggressive. 
Oh, nice overhand, overhand right from Blair. Oh, another big overhand right from Blair. Blair, Blair, Blair pulled that round out too, man. All right, walkouts, man. We got, we got McKinney and uh, Terrence T. Rex McKinney right now. All right, y'all. First round. McKinney. Oh, big, big uppercut. Oh, nice straight right hand from McKinney. McKinney going to catch this kid, man. Look at his jab, though. Oh, man, that one, two from McKinney, man. Kind of stumbled Gonzalez. Oh, man, McKinney piecing him up, man. Oh, he piecing them up. Gonzalez trying to get her. Uh... Oh, big knees, big elbows. Oh, man, McKinney trying to kill him. Oh, Eric Gonzalez caught McKinney with a nice right hook, man. Oh, man. But well, McKinney's fine. Oh, and he dumps. He dumps Eric Gonzalez on his back. McKinney's got the back. He's got the hooks in. Uh oh. He's trying to get a rep. Yeah. He's trying to get a choke. He try oh, he tapped him out. McKinney tapped him out. It's over, bro. First round submission, bro. Terrence McKinney tapped him out. I got Terrence McKinney on whole, all my cards, bro. You can tell this kid was this was an overmatch. That's why this was a lock. This was a lock for me, man. First round sub. Blair Cobb still bouncing. Still moving. Maurice Hooker want Blair Cobbs to stand there, but Blair's like, nah, man, I'm going I'm to move.
Oh, we got uh, Terrence Crawford and Bo Mack in the corner. Maurice Hooker. Maurice Hooker. Terrence said, do you hear me? Get your left foot outside of his right. Scotty Boy said, I need a McKinney by TKO. Oh, man, okay. Scotty Boy said, screwed. Yeah, he won by sub, bro. First round. Rear naked. He rear naked him like a backpack. He was on his back like a backpack. You had McKinney KO round two. Terrence, T-Rex, McKinney. Maurice Hooker looks terrible, bro. Maurice Hooker just falling to the ground. Oh, he wants Patty. He wants Patty Pimblett. He called out Patty Pimblett. Terrence McKinney. I would love to see that fight, bro. Oh my God. I would love to see that fight. Yeah, he he been inactive. Yeah, he he has. He looking, he, he's not looking good at all, bro. Blair Cobb's winning this fight. I'm surprised. Blair, Blair in shape too, man. He moving. This is round nine. And and, and 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 Hooker's just missing everything, bro. Blair's moving amazing, bro. I don't know why he want Patty versus Connor. Connor might mess around and knock knock uh Patty Pimlet out, man. Blair Cobb putting on a boxing clinic, man, right now, Maurice Hooker. <laughs> go! Let's go, Blair. Get him, Blair. He just, he moving too well. He's moving too well for him, man. Maurice don't know what to do. He don't know what to do. Now, now Maurice look like he wants to, Maurice look like he want to, Maurice look like he want to chase him down. One, two from Blair, and he's out of there. One, two, and out. Yo, Blair boxing, bro. Blair is boxing, bro. Blair is out boxing this boy, man. Oh, I'm so glad, bro. Dag, your parlay is ruined, Scotty said. I got speed back by knockout in second round over Sakai. I got speed back. Yeah, he's gonna need a knockout.
Dag, man. Scotty Boy, he says Parlay is ruined. That's because you had you had him. You need you needed McKinney by TKO. That's why. Okay. That sucks, man. That's why UFC is so tough. Easier in boxing to get TKOs because you know they can't do anything else. But you see a lot of times when these KO artists get guys hurt, they'll get them down and just choke them out, you know? So it can... It's just weird, man. They have to take what they what what's given to them. Oh man, Scotty, man, Dag, I'm sorry to hear that, bro. Damn. Oh, this fight. Let me. Let me. Let me. Thirty-four seconds left. Blair Cobb surviving. Oh, nice, nice short right left hand from Blair Cobb's, bro. Maurice need Maurice know he needs a uh, he know he needs a uh, knockout. Nineteen seconds left. Blair smart. He 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 just. That's the end of the fight. Where Kyle's won that fight, bro. Blair won that fight, bro. Heavyweights, I got Spivak. I got TKO in the second round for Spivak, man. Because I'm telling you, um, Sakai been getting KO by everybody, bro. Oh man, he caught him and hurt. He 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 hurt. Oh, he knocked him down. Blair Cobb's got a knockdown on Maurice Sucker, bro. He knocked him down. Oh shoot! I didn't even catch that. That must have happened in that round. Yeah, he dropped him. Blair Cobb's dropped Maurice Hooker right on his behind, bro. Blair Cobb's won that fight. Clearly won that fight. Unanimous decision, bro. Yeah, Terrence, Terrence and Bo Mac, they know he lost that fight. Blair, Blair showed up and showed out, man. I don't see him beating no top level fighters, though, man. He just ain't, he ain't got it, man. Somebody like Boots would kill him, bro. Knock him out. It's a unanimous decision. Ninety-seven, ninety. 96 to 91.
Blair to Flair Cobbs. Unanimous decision, bro. Blair Cobbs looks amazing, bro. I, I like, I mean, I'm just saying, I like his footwork, bro. Great conditioning, bro. I mean, that boy was still moving with his footwork into the 12th, in the, into the uh, 10th round, bro. I mean, moving amazing, bro. Yeah. He he had the better game plan, man. He was just way quicker. Uh, we're still waiting. We're waiting on these walkouts, man, from Augusto Sakai, Sergey Spivak. Wow, bro. Man, he hurt. He knocked him down. He knocked Maurice Hooker down in the first and second round, bro. Y'all Sears in the house, man. We've been looking for you, bro. Salute them. Salute them, my man. Uh Y'all Sear. Yes, sir. We got one of my other boys is in the house, man. We got some new people in here, man. Salute. Uh, Scotty Boy, we got Scotty Boy and Sean in here. Chemo's asking, um, how did you lose money on that submission, Scotty Boy? I think Scotty Boy had him by K KO and they he won by submission, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe Scotty Boy can explain it. Yeah, man. Uh Yasir, man. I was telling tell him we, we you know we've been we was in here yesterday for PFL, man. We got some new guys in here, man. Scotty Boy. Uh we got Sean Spencer in here. Um and uh I was telling him about my people, man. Yeah, Yasir is in salute to all the all the new people, man. Yeah, man. I was telling him about you and Derek yesterday and, and the rest of our crew, man. I said, uh I said, you'll see them in here. They'll be in here. They'll come through. You had McKinney by TKO. Okay, Scotty, he's he's uh, replying to Chemo. Yeah, salute to all the new people. Derek Bailey in the chat saying salute to all the brothers. Salute to Chemo too, man. Oh, uh, you bet on just winners. I, I I hear you. Oh yeah, I was on yesterday. Hey, y'all see her, man. When you get a chance, man, go back and check out that contender series. It was the best contender series. Uh, dude, That I'll put that contender series up against any UFC card, bro. It was that good, man. All five fighters got contracts, man. You you, you just have to see it, man. It uh trended. It trended worldwide, man. It was just you got to go back and check out. Uh, season six, week two, La this past Tuesday, man. You got to see that. Uh, uh, y'all see her, man. Yeah, please go check it out. Chemo says, I didn't bet on any rounds and type of finishes this time, just the winners. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, that's what I, I, I wasn't sure that's what um, Scotty was, was doing. I thought he just needed wins, but he had methods, uh, to go with it, and yeah, that's that's kind of. That's tough, but it's big money if you hit. You know what I'm saying? Blair Cobb's got the decision. Yeah, I just finished watching it, y'all see. I mean, he boxed, he he boxed that boy head off, man. Knocked him down twice. I'm like, what? I missed the knockdowns because I came in around the fourth round. Michael McKinson's in trouble, man, messing with with Ortiz, bro. I'm sorry to say it. I got I, I got to say it again, man. I don't know what Michael McKenzie. Oh, we're in the first round, man. Let me get to this, man. Speedbox got um Sakai on his back already, man, and uh, he's already got uh Sakai on his back, bro. 
I got speed. I got speed back by second round KO, man. Big shots. Big shots coming in from speed out. Sky Sky is all right though on the ground though. He's not no slouch on the ground, but he's inside control. Oh. He was trying to get an arm bar. Big hot, big head kick, big big head shots. Big shots coming in from Sakai. Big shots coming in from uh uh Spivak, my fault. I said Sakai. But Spivak, big shots. Oh, big shots to the ear, bro. Big shots. Sakai's up to his feet. Spivak still got the back. He takes him down again. Big shots. Three takedowns already. Yeah, yeah, y'all see it, man. Maurice was fighting dirty, man. I was calling it the whole time, man. I said, he's fighting dirty, bro. Maurice Hooker was hitting behind the head and everything, bro. Another takedown for Spivak, side control, big elbows. Oh, he's trying for. Big shots. Oh, them a big shot to the side of the head, bro. He trying to get he's trying to choke Sakai out now, man. Yeah, he put a hole in the man's head, man. Y'all see it. Yes, he did, bro. You saw that? That was a bad cut. Big shots by Speed Rock. Oh, he tried to get him, but Sakai got out of it. He's standing right now. 50 seconds left. Man, Sakai knocked this guy out, man. I'm telling you, Spivak, you better not get knocked out by Sakai, bro. Yeah, he... Oh, big shots! Big shots from S Spivak, bro. Speedbox like he gassing though. Sakai might knock this guy out later on in rounds, man, if he don't finish him. That's the end of the first round. Yeah, you saw that too, y'all see it, man. Maurice was fighting dirty, man. He was hitting mine in the head. That's all right. I was, yo, I was rooting Blair on that whole fight. I was like, get him, Blair, get him. Blair was landing combinations and moving, and yo, Blair fought a, a awesome fight, bro. He stuck to his game plan. He moved. Maurice was too slow. He was too slow for him, man. Hooker sh shots, you could see him a mile away, man, coming, man. Yeah, throwing him after the bell, bro. Yo, he was fighting dirty. Maurice said, I, man, I can't beat you. I got I, I to gotta try to cheat you. If I can't beat you, I'll cheat you. 
Second round. Oh, big heavy straight jab. Another big straight left hand jab for for uh Spivak. Snapping the head back of Sakai. Sakai, Sakai. Look at Sakai just swinging that air. Another jab for Spivak. Oh, look at that jab of Spivak. Just got the nose bloody to Sakai right now. Another jab. Another straight jab from Spivak. Spivak is killing him with this jab, bro. Snapping his head back, picks him up, and slams him. Five takedowns. This might be it this round, bro. Come on, man. Finish him by ground and pound, bro, so I can get this 100 points, man. I need some ground and pound, bro. Sakai trying to get up. He's up. He's trying to get a takedown of his own. But I doubt it. Big shots from Spivak. Big shots to the head. Big shots to the head from Spivak. Oh, nice trip by Sakai. Nice judo throw. Back to his back again, man. What's that? Six takedown? Big shots coming in by Spivak. Big elbows, big shots, big shots. Stop him. Come on, let's go. Get him, Peabot. Two minutes left, man. Sakai trying to get up. Hook the leg, man. They're telling you to hook the leg. That's it. Stop it. Stop it, ref. Come on, ref. Come on. Couple more shots, man. Couple more shots. That's it. That's it. Yes. Woo! Got to KO in the second round. Got to KO in the second round, baby. Let's go. Ah, yes. 100 points, baby. And I got him on uh, DraftKings. Let's go, Spivak. Man, I needed that, bro. Woo! Wow. This is only... Okay. I'm back in the money on DraftKings. Wow. That was good. That was good. That was good, bro. Oh, speed back KO second round. That's a hundred. Woo! Let's go. Wow, man. Let's go, UFC. 
I only got one loss, man. That first, I don't know why I switched that Stephanie Edgar and Myra Bueno Silva match, man. I screwed up. Derek said, I had Spivak KO 2-2. Two, two. Good. Good job. Oh, this is going to be a fight here, guys. This is for the uh, Flyweight uh, Contender Series Championship, man, this next fight. Walker and Miller. Who would you guys take? Y'all seeing Derek for this one, man. Miller's taller. She's very aggressive. Brogan Walker's got the more experience, though, man. Yeah, man. Thanks. Thanks, Yasir. He said good pick. Yeah, man. We uh yeah, I picked I picked Spivak by second round KO, man. You can't remember? Okay. I could check for you. Let me see where you at. Let me check. Let me go here. I'm still clinging in the first place, man, in the UFC. Sergey Va. This is the last one. This is the last uh, for the season, guys. This is the last a uh, match for the season. We start a new season after this. Um, let me see here. What y'all see here? What y'all see here? Who y'all see here got? Yasir had um yes yeah, oh you had um speed back by submission in round three. That's that's what uh Yasir had, yes. You had him by submission in round three. I knew he was going to stop. I knew he was going to stop Sakai, man. Sakai is just a knockout, getting knocked out machine. <laughs> He's been getting... He won a bonus. He won a bonus. He said, I have nine fights. You know, give me bonus. Give me bonus. <laughs> That's how. I... Oh, you got Miller by decision. Wow. Okay. I think I took. Uh... Who did I take, man? Oh, I got to check. I got to check. I took Walker by decision. Wow, I took Walker by decision. That was huge, that 100 points. Yeah, I took Broken Walker by decision. Wow, Derek, we got opposite ones. Let me see. Freddie didn't put no picks in. Let me check, man. I didn't see that. What happened with Freddie, man? Freddie don't never miss his picks. Let me see. Nope. He ain't put him in. Dag, Freddie was in the winning, too, man. He was up there, man. He was in second place. Oh, Fred, come on, man. Freddie works a lot, man. Freddie works a whole bunch, man. He probably just slipped, man, and missed the deadline, bro. 
Come on, Freddie, bro. God, that's it, man. He can't even win, man. He was up there. He was in he was in second place. He was in second place. Wow, Freddie. Freddie dropped the ball on that one. That's my girl, Brogan, right there, man. Come on, Brogan. I like Juliana, though. Juliana, Juliana's a little thug, man. Gianna's like a thug, bro. We're going to see what Juliana can do. She gets hit a lot, man. She's got poor head movement. She's got poor head movement, man, but. She she she's a dog. She coming straight forward. Yeah, I think Brogan got the better power of the two. Let's hope this ain't nothing like that that uh that 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 Pena and New Year's rematch. I'm telling you, man, that was that was crazy dominance, man. Pena just God, I thought Pena was gonna come out and I was I had butterflies in that fight. I said, man, Pena, she come out here and do that same thing, bro. But I, I, I just knew. I said, there's no way Nunez better better not be prepared for this fight, bro. Yep. Kimo said, I got Miller by decision, too. Okay, you got Miller, too. All right. Let me see. What do I got? Uh oh, you got bro. You you got you got uh oh you got you got Miller, Juliana um Miller. Okay. I took Broken Walker, man, just because of the experience, man. She gotta be careful on the ground. This girl can this girl is is nice on the ground. Um Miller's nice on the ground, bro. Cause she's long and linky. But Brogan's strong. That you know, Brogan's the stronger fighter of the two. And I believe Brogan um has got the experience to uh to uh fight submissions and stuff. But Miller Miller can't slow down because she comes out mad aggressive, man. She and the thing is she still comes forward, but her head, her head, she keeps her head right on the line, man. And if Miller's got any type of IQ, man, she's just going to shoot them straight shots at her, man. But, uh, I mean, Walker, Walker. But, uh, like I said, the dog in this fight is definitely Miller, man. She's a dog, man. I can't take no. That's why I say the best one's going to win this fight, but it's winnable for each one of them, I believe. But Miller is just... She is not playing, bro.
<laughs> she got her little beagle puppy. Y'all see her say, I got Walker by decision. Yeah, I took Walker. Oh, she threw a kiss at Broken Walker. She said, go ahead, underestimate me if you want to. I love I love Broken though. Broken's strong, man. Brogan's just a strong, she's strong, man. We're going to see. All right, here they come. Look at Juliana. Juliana, Juliana be cracking me up, bro. Juliana Miller, she's something else, bro. Nah, Pettis, Pettis, Pettis lost last night, man. Yep. Pettis lost, man. He lost. Yeah, he lost. Stevie Ray beat him, man. So now it's um, Auburn Mercier and Stevie Ray in the championship. I got Auburn Mercier winning that whole thing, man. Two Canadians. Two Canadians in the uh, P PFL championship. Yep. Yeah, he took he he took uh, he took uh, Pettis to the mat, man, and pretty much, you know, dominated him on the mat. Pettis had his his moments during the fight, but Stevie Ray won, man. Yeah, Pettis is man. His better days are gone, man. He, you know he should be right now in the corner of his brother, the champ, Bellator champ, uh, Sergio Pettis, man. He should be in his corner, man. You know, coaching him, man, because. Uh, Pettis' days are over, man. He he he's an ex champ. He had his time, but I knew he was even when he became champ. I said he's just not built to keep this championship, man, because it's too inconsistent. And he wasn't dominant. You know what I mean? That's what I look for in champs, man. Most of the champs were, were dominant. You know, dominant fighters. You know. And they train like that. You know, every once in a while you see a champ, a guy come along, win the championship, you know. But I always look at it like, can can he maintain it? Can he defend it? And a lot of these guys just can't, they can't maintain it, man, because they aren't dominant fighters, you know. They're just, you know, decent fighters. I don't know, man. I think they're probably going to throw them on next week. But um, my key guy got, man, that screwed up my DraftKings, man, because I had Josh King Lon, man. That kid is a problem, and he undefeated. He was making his debut against Jason Witt. And that fight got canceled, and a woman's fight, Cochiera against um, Lipsky, Ariana Lipsky. Two fights got canceled tonight. Yeah, I was pissed, man. I was like, dang, Josh King Lon. He, I had him on every one of my lineups, bro. I had to go back and adjust every last one of my lineups, man. 
Because I know he was a lock, bro. He was my lock for the night, man. Him and McKinney, man. Him and Terrence McKinney. And we see what Terrence McKinney did. Sub in the first round. Out, man. God, that screwed me over, man. Because I said Jason Witt has no chance against this kid, bro. Uh oh. She's staring her opponent down, smiling. Let's go, Brogan. Let's go. Look at Julian shaking her head like, yeah, all right. All right. Look at her. Juliana, Ju Juliana looking like a deer in the headlights right now. She's like, all right, you want it? You want it? I'm going to give it to you. I'll go, Juliana. Blessings, Juliana. She healed up pretty good, man, from that fight. She healed up good. She got makeup on, but she's sunglasses, but she's still fine. She fine. She fine. She fine. Chris, Chris Tucker voice. She fine, man. She fine. So Miller is the favorite at minus 130. I'm going for the underdog, man. Come on, underdog. Oh, come on, Brogan. Brogan's smiling at her. Brogan's giving her a smile. And Juliana looking at her like, why are you picking on me like that? Why you look, why are you picking on me like that? Look at Juliana. Juliana staring, trying to stare through her. Juliana ain't breaking her. She is not breaking it. Brogan looking at her smiling. Yeah, she's smiling. She's shaking her head like, yeah, what? What, Juliana? Let's get it. You don't want none of this smoke. All right, y'all. Let me stop talking junk, man. Because <laughs> I know one thing. Uh, Juliana Miller is coming right at her, bro. She is not. I, well, that's what she usually does. I'm going to see if she does it now. But, but Brogan got a look on her eyes right now. Brogan's like, yo. You don't know what you just did. Do did. All right, here we here they go. Oh no, Brogan walking up on her. Oh, nice left left hook coming from uh from from Miller. Nice leg kick. Oh, Walker. Walker just. Reversed her real quick. Uh-oh, she takes Brogan down. Miller takes Brogan down. She's on top. Nice takedown. Get to the hip. Get to the hip. Wow. All right, Miller. Miller's got that. Miller got that BJJ going on right now, man. All right, Walker. That's right. Get that butterfly hook in, Brogan. Shots coming to the head from uh from Miller. I don't know why this is still on walkouts. It shouldn't be on walkouts. There we go.
All right, she on top. She's con she's uh controlling right now. Landing shots. Come on, Brogan. Let's get something going, man. Come on, man. Let's try to get a triangle in there. Let's try to get a triangle in there. Uh oh. Another round for sure. Another round for sure. Dominated that round, bro. Dominated. All right, Brogan, you better shoot. You down one. Gonna need these next two, girl. It don't look like bro. I don't look. It doesn't look like Brogan can keep her. I, I don't know, man. She 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 got caught out there, man, by getting letting her get that those uh. Getting that clinch, man. I'm gonna have to defend better, man. Damn it. But I knew, I knew either one of these fighters couldn't win this fight, man. I knew Juliana Miller could definitely win this fight. Here we go. Second round. Juliana feeling good about herself, though. All right. All right, Brogan. All right, Brogan. Oh, she got a black eye right now, Brogan, dude. Oh, straight jab right now. Walker ain't looking good, bro. Rogan ain't looking good, man. Rogan ain't looking good. Juliana's looking real good and patient.
Oh, uh, see, this is what Brogan don't want to do. She don't want to get into this, man, with this girl, man. She going to take you down again. She takes her down again. What are you doing? Come on, Brogan, man. Come on, Brogan. Get up, man. Get up. Oh, man. This girl can grapple, bro. She's trying to get a choke. Uh-oh, broken. Brogan don't look good at all, bro. I mean, Brogan don't look good at all. Yeah, Miller's better, man. She's better. She's a better fighter. She's a better fighter. This girl can fight Miller. Yeah, Brogan's gassing. She's gassing too. Take down again. He said Miller has a funny shaped body. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, Brogan ain't Brogan ain't gonna she ain't got nothing for Miller, bro. Brogan getting beat up bad, bro. Wow. Dominance. Dominance. Three takedowns. I don't know why she clinching with her. What are you clinching with her for? So that's what I'm saying about how fighters lose their game plan in the ring. You know you can't grapple with this girl, right? So why are you clinching with her? 
You should be just trying to piece her up, man, on the feet, man. All right, Brogan. Let's go, Brogan. Let's see what you got. You ain't got nothing for her because she's just waiting to counter you. Oh, big left hook from Miller. Miller beating her up, man. Miller beating her up bad, bad, bro. Miller can't even close the distance. She can't even close the distance, man. She doesn't even know how to close the distance. Get out of the clinch. Get out of the clinch, Brogan. Get out of the clinch. She's going to take you down again. Get out of the clinch. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. She's beat. She She's killing this girl. This girl sucks, man. Brogan, you suck, bro. You suck, bro, Brogan. You're screwed now. You she's she's got full mount on you. She's gonna kill you. She's gonna kill you now. Look at these big elbows. They're gonna stop it. She's killing Brogan Barrel. Stop this fight, man. Stop this damn fight, man. She's taking too many elbows, bro. Taking too many elbows, bro. She's she wasn't ready for this fight. Kimo needs Miller to just survive, bro. Oh. That might be it. That's going to be it, bro. Yeah, that's going to be it. You see Juliana Miller push Brogan in the head after she, uh, yeah, she took too many elbows, bro. That's why I said stop that fight, man. Stop that doggone fight. But did you see, did you see, you see what Ju Juliana Miller did after she got up? She pushed Brogan in the head, man, while she was getting up, man. That wasn't cool, man. You already beat her up, man. You didn't have to disrespect her like that man push her head i get it it's 
This girl can fight, though. Fifty, fifty. You had decision. Yeah, that's only fifty points, Derek. Yeah, you saw that too, right? She just pushed her in the head when she got up. She beat her up bad, bro. Damn, Brogan, I thought you thought you make me look better than that. Wow. Who y'all got in this next one, man? Usman versus uh, Praga. Yeah, you said, Derek said, I wasn't sure if she would have stopped Walker. No, I wasn't sure either. I, 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 I would. She had the capabilities too, man. Definitely did. And someone was telling me before I, I pick Walker, I picked her based on experience, but some told me to pick the better grappler in Miller, but I just took uh I took Brogan. You got Praga. Yeah, me too, Derek. And uh Yasir. This girl can fight, man. I like that style she came out because she usually just comes straight forward at you, but she was patient and was just catching this girl. I, I love her fights. I love this adjustment. Great job, baby. Great job, baby. Great job. You did an excellent job. Pina. Pina was her coach. Juliana Pina. Yep. She going to be a problem for a lot of people, man. But she's gonna, she's. Oh man, Brogan was trying to talk. Brogan was screwing up. You got Praga too, although Usman is a tank. Yeah. Praga's got more tools in the toolbox, man. <laughs> Derek said, yeah, they cheated my girl Pena last week. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. Nunez cheated her, man. He cheated her with them takedowns and, 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 and that ground and foul. <laughs> Nunez cheated her. Deontay Wilder's in the house, boy. Oh, he back training, man. He's about to announce his fight next week. Yo, Yasir said, Derek, really? <laughs> Derek, you see how Derek do us, Yasir? 
You see how you do us, right? Yeah. Yeah, Wilder is there. The champ is there, bro. The champ about to, about to announce his fight next week, man. Whoever he's fighting, he back training. Yeah. Sugar Sean O'Malley is in for a, 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 a hell of a fight against Peter Yan, man, former champ, man. I don't think he's ready yet for Peter Yan, man. But we're going to see. We're going to see. We are going to see. He said, you hear Derek? Derek said, yep, they should test Nunez for steroids. <laughs> hey, y'all see it. You see how you see how he doing us? You see what he you see what he's saying to us, right? Oh man, he said we cheating, man. He said we they should be testing us for testing for steroids. He said they should be testing us for steroids. Jack Planga. Oh man, this is gonna be a good one, bro. Muhammad Usman better not wrestle in this, man. Y'all see her laughing at Derek. You heard you see what you see how he trying to take our 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 W away from us, man. Yeah, Derek trying to get that. Derek trying to get that that lot that L back, man. He said, "Man, he said that was a fluke, man. That wasn't that wasn't right." Muhammad better not come in here trying to grapple, bro, because that's. I don't, uh, I don't want him gassing out later on in this fight, man. You can't gas out against Pranga, man. Man, we got the World Series coming up next month, man. I mean, a uh, month after next. It's almost here. Football season coming up the end of this month. End of this month, the beginning of next month. All right. Let's go, baby. Yeah, I'll be back here for the Contender Series on Tuesday night. And uh, if we got any other big... Uh, let me look at the schedule, man. Let's see what other things we got going on man let me see what i'll do which ones i'll pull off yeah uh pfl playoffs i'll be doing that on um, no uh, no nah, i won't be doing 12 p.m i may start off with the pfl on saturday next saturday but then i'll switch over to ufc um, cause we got welterweights and heavyweights, but then I'll be switching over to, um, UFC at four 30. So I'll do like four and a half hours of PFL. And then I'll switch over to UFC next Saturday, Vera versus Cruz. But uh, I'll be here on Tuesday for Danny White's contender, um, contender series.
Yeah, Gracie versus Yamauchi um, is Bellator, but I might not be able to cover that one. Then we're going to do, um, we're going to do PFL on, um, on one, uh, next Saturday, we're going to do PFL, the women's, uh, we're going to do featherweights and women's lightweights, and then we'll do Usman Edwards too, the following week. And then I'll continue doing the, uh, contender series. Until that's done. All right. Usman said. Yeah, he says he's fighting for his son. Yeah, his son died, Derek. Yeah, yeah, his son died, bro. That tore him up, man. That tore him up, bro. But that's who he fight for, man. He always he always say he fight for his son, man. Dangerous man, man. He's nowhere near. He's got he he I only thing I don't like is um, you'll see it when he throws a punch, the way he ducks his head after he throws the punch. I know he's he's getting out of range, but I, I, I just don't think he's he's not doing it right. He's not he's not moving his head right. You know, somebody picks up on that. Um, it's not going to be good for him. You know what I mean? Like he got to learn to move his head you know, in the, you know, like, like boxers do, you know what I'm saying? He's just got a weird way. You'll see what I'm saying when he throws a punch, how he, how he, how he throw, he ducks his head now. And, uh, I didn't like that, man. I just didn't like that. I mean, it's been working for him, but he, 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 he drops his head. Yeah. He just, Man, if Usman wins this, man, I'm going to be, oh, my God, I'm going to be blown away. I took Praga, but I, I'd like to see Usman win this, man, but I'm going to be blown away, man. I'm going to be blown away if he wins this fight, bro. I know Usman, I know Kamara's going to be so, so hyped, man, if he wins. He's definitely fought the better competition than um, Zach Quaga, man. He's fought the, you know, I've seen Usman f fight, you know, high level competition, but, you know, it, granted, he's got a couple losses, but um, he's been in there with, with some real heavyweights, you know. And he got away from his grappling. He's, he's more of a striker now. He don't grapple like he used to. He used to pick dudes up and just body them. Boom. He doesn't do that much anymore, man. I think you should always, always train uh, to have grappling cardio, man, R whether you use it or not. You, you know, so that way during the fight, if you if you beating somebody up on the feet, there's no need to use it. But if you need to take somebody down, say you're behind, you need to take somebody down and. And, and catch up on a round or something, man. You, you always have it. You know, that's why I say it's, uh, you know, UFC is just, it, it's not a stand-up game anymore, man. I mean, it, you know, it shouldn't be just limited to stand-up, you know. That's why I I value guys that can grapple and strike. Yeah, less grappling is easier in the cardio. That's what I'm saying. That's why I say 
grapple if you if, if you train grapple heavy then you you'll be able to do it during the fight at any time you know what i'm saying yeah just like uh khabib man khabib would practice he would he would grapple for hours at practice hours at practice that's why his cardio was he, he was unmatched bro unmatched bro Yeah. And what you call it too? Um Kobe Covington, man. That's why that's why Kobe Kobe granted Kamaru Usman was the only one to really uh to to stop him, but Kobe's cardio is out of this world, bro. Like cuz he he grapples heavy when he when he trains, you know? But that just goes to show you how good Kamaru Usman is, man. Kamal Usman is just a, a whole nother beast, bro. 100% takedown defense, man. It's crazy. And he can just earth you any at any moment during a fight. Just pick you up and just <laughs> you see how he ragdolled. Uh, uh, I, I, yo, I couldn't believe it, man. When he when he ragdolled, um, um. Uh, Tyrone Woodley, man. I said, no way, bro. There's no way he's manhandling Tyrone Woodley who can grapple, bro. I mean, ragdoll him. All right, here we go. 33 for Muhammad Lutzen, 34 for Puaga, 8 and 2 for Muhammad, 6 and 0 for Puaga. They're both the same height. And uh, Muhammad Usman has a three inch uh, reach advantage. Praga is what three more, three more, three pounds heavier. Yeah, I see. I see where the extra weight is coming right around his waist. Oh man, here we go. All right, Usman, let's see what you got, man. Praga. Uh oh, Muhammad Usma out of Denver, Colorado. He trains at high altitude too, so he should be in shape, man. He be training at high altitude. Smart. All right. And Muhammad's built like a damn truck, bro. All right, here we go. First round, baby. All right, here we go. Oh, Plaga comes out with a kick. Oh, Usman just missed with an uppercut. What a Superman jab. See, this is what I, I figured that Usman was going to do. This is what I figured he's going to do. He's going to get out, outworked. Because Usman's more, he's trying to counterpunch, man.
Yeah, see, that's why. See, this saying exactly what I'm saying. Usman's got to be first, man. He's waiting, man. He, I don't know why he's waiting, bro. What are you waiting on, bro? Look at you, man. He's swinging all at the air again, man. You just got to stop waiting, man. Stop waiting for this guy, man. Can't, can't win like this, man. He caught Puaga, though. He caught him on a nice little... that. See how Usman waiting? He's waiting. Stop waiting, bro. You waiting. Step in, man. Step in and faint and faint and faint. See how he's dropping his head, Derek? Yeah, his cardio should be great then, like you said, yeah. I don't know what Hoosman's doing, man. This is why. This is why. This is why I just couldn't pick him, man, because of what he's doing right now. I guess he's trying to get Praga to come in, man. He's trying to get Praga to come in and uh, encounter, but that's not that's not how we win this fight, man. That's the little hook, left hook lands for Usman. See, that's when that's when Usman should have unloaded right there, bro. See how Usman, he's off, man. He way off, bro. You way off. Nice left hook land from uh Usman. Come on, Mo, man. You you looking terrible in there, man. Yeah, you see that, right, Derek? Uppercut waiting to happen, bro. That's that's my point. Uppercut waiting to happen, bro. And he loves to come in wild and, and wing. Come on, man. All you need is a short hook, man, to stop all that. I don't. I, that's why I couldn't pick him, man. I couldn't pick him. Couldn't pick him, bro. Round two, baby. Coming up. Ding, coming up. All right, here we go. Round two, baby. Yeah, he... Nah, I don't think he's overrated. I don't, I don't think he was rated, period. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, you saying Kamara Usman's overrated? I know you ain't saying Kamara Usman's overrated. You talking about Muhammad Usman's overrated, Scotty? Because Us Kamara Usman ain't overrated, bro. He's he beating up everybody they put in front of him, man. Like who who else is there? Oh, it's over. Muhammad knocks him out. 
He knocks him out. He knocks him out. Oh my God, yo. Yo. Oh my God. Yo, look at Kamara. Look at Kamara. Kamara is like, let's go. Oh, that's wicked. He's still down, bro. Oh, his brother. LOL. He said, nah, his brother. Oh, my God. I picked him. Oh, look at that. Oh, my God. He caught him, guys. And I knew he had it in him to catch him. He was, dude, do you see that wasn't even hard? That wasn't even hard, bro. That wasn't even hard, bro. Muhammad Usman wins the ultimate, the contender series, bro. Oh, my God, that was ugly. Look at, look at Kamara, boy. Kamara went crazy. <laughs> Yo! That was crazy, bro. I did not expect that, bro. Yo, man. I picked Usman on my DraftKings, too, and I didn't think he was going to win, bro. Oh, my God. Yes. Yep. I'm winning more money now, man. Oh, my God. That was good, man. I wanted them to win, man. I, I took Praga, but God, man. And I was envisioning this last night. I was in the bed, man. Um, and I was uh, I was playing um, chess. And I just, I had a vision, man. I said, yo, what if, what if Usman knocks this guy out, man? That will be crazy. And he did it, bro. Scotty said that was crazy. I knew something weird was gonna happen. <laughs> Scotty said, I take that back. <laughs> wow, man, I didn't see that coming, bro. I am so happy for Muhammad right now, bro. Cause I, I just knew that this guy, I mean, it's been a long road for Muhammad Usman, man. Like I said, he's fought in other organizations, bro, and he's been fairly successful, but he lost some fights that I, he shouldn't have lost, you know? And um, to come out and do this and knock out Zach like that, that was crazy, bro. That was crazy, bro. Yo, Muhammad, look at Kamal Usman's about the same size as his brother, bro. Wow, both Julian Pena fighters won, man. Yep. I tell I knew it. I said, Dag, man fighting for a son. Dangerous man. He didn't even need to hit him again. God, he didn't even put anything on that punch, bro. All you gotta do is catch somebody on the chin just right. 
I mean, he was out. He was out, bro. Wow, first brothers to win the ultimate fighter. I like I like he keeps saying that he can't get, wait to get back to work. Get back to work. He got his mom right there with him. She got some monsters for sons, man. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I don't think Dominic Cruz got anything from Cheeto Vera. Dominic Cruz is not active enough, man. If Cheeto Vera is going to beat him, bro, Cheeto is just dangerous, bro. Now don't get me wrong, um, Dominic, and he hasn't he hasn't been using his grappling in forever, bro. Like Cruz last fight was probably a year and a half ago, man. Maybe, man. Maybe even two years, man. He man, I can't go with I I can't I can't Cruz fights every blue moon, bro. Like Cheeto Vera has just been active and he's he's just he's more dangerous. Cruz ain't gonna do nothing but run around the ring, man. He's not gonna grapple when, and that's what he's really known for. He's not gonna do none of that, man. Like he's been trying to stand up, and he looks, he just doesn't look, he doesn't look right, man. There's no way I go for Dominic Cruz, bro, against Cheeto Vera, man. Yeah, man. He's, I, he, yo, it's been forever since he's been. And this Dominic Cruz that they're showing right now, this is the old Dominic Cruz. This ain't no new Dominic Cruz, bro. They're showing highlights of him. That's old Dominic Cruz, bro. It's not even new Dominic Cruz. He's looked terrible, man. Yeah, Cruz gonna box, man. That's what he does, Derek. Box and move. Box and move. He's gonna. He's just gonna be his footwork. He's got great footwork. I like his footwork, but that's all he's gonna do is try to box and move. And Vera gonna, Vera gonna mess around and catch him with something, man. But Cheeto got Cheeto, Cheeto swing with bad intentions, man. Yep. Vincente Luque and Jeff Neal. This fight here could go either way, man. I mean, Jeff Neal catching with that power, man. But Jeff, Jeff is too passive for me, man. He's too passive, man. And he's probably, I don't know. He's, he, I don't know, man. He can't go in here being uh, intimidated by Vincente Luque, man. But Jeff just, Jeff got hands, man. I got Luque too, man. I took Luque too. I took Usman on DraftKings, bro. I'm so glad I did, man. God, I'm so glad I did, bro. Cause I had to take him. I had to take an underdog, and I, I, I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a chance on Usman, man, because he can, he can end this fight with one punch, man. And sure enough, man, I, I would have never in a million years thought he would have knocked Praga out, man. No way. Wow, man. Wow, man, that was something else. Dag, everybody must have had the same picks because I'm still in uh, first place in the USC, man.
Yeah, the, the only one close is uh, Freddie Fist and Freddie Fist and Yasir. Yasir is um in basically in second place, um, and then Freddie Fist and Freddie Fist didn't even put any he didn't even put any what you call it in man. Imagine if Freddie Fist had to put he probably be he he probably be winning. He would probably be winning, man, if he had to put his picks in, bro. Derek got Derek got the most points um right now, but Derek is just he's too far behind to catch catch up. But uh Derek Derek got 430 points, man. Then uh then uh me and Skinny got 300. Yeah. Wow, Derek killing us right now. Imagine if we were tied up, man. Derek would... Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna post those. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna make the new uh, what you call it. I'm sending those invites out. So check before Monday, man, guys. Make sure you check you check uh, Tapology for the invites on Monday because I may put the Contender Series in um, in for uh, the next season, man. Because the season's gonna start. This is the last one of this of the UFC season right here, bro. This is the last one. And the way things look, it looks like I'm probably gonna take first place in, in this one because I think we all I think everybody got Luke, man, pretty much, man. Cause I know I got Luke. I got Luke winning. Unless somebody got a different you know what I'm saying? Nah, I, I don't I just I think it's pretty much who you got, Yasir, for um Hill versus Santos. If y'all see her still here. Jeff Neal, Jeff Neal is just too, he's too patient for me, man. I mean, I mean, and, and, and maybe, maybe that works for him because Luke A is, can be kind of aggressive. You got Luke and Hill. See, yeah, I got Luke and Hill too. So, like I said, this season's pretty much over with, man. And uh, so you guys be checking, man. Check, check, check for Monday, man, because I might put the contender series in, which starts Tuesday. So get those picks in. I'm gonna put it in. I'm gonna put it in. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it tonight. When this is done, I'm gonna go in and make the new season for UFC. So look for the 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 uh invites this weekend, guys. Uh make sure you guys check this weekend for the invites because I I'm putting them in, man. And then then I'll send uh messages out to Skinny and the rest of the guy. Tatar is always on there, so he's going to see it. Um and uh hopefully these guys will, you know, you know the rest of the guys, but I'm letting you guys know so you'll know. Um, Scotty, if you you guys um got topology, if Scotty or anybody else in the chat, man, have um topology, if you got a topology account, man, yo, you can join us our fantasy league, man. And uh, you know, and uh, uh join in, man. Yeah, we be playing for prizes too, man. On um, Derek, Derek, Derek been killing us. He won. He won. He won the last season. Um, we got the boxing season still going. That that's still going right now. And I'm hanging in in uh, in the boxing. I think who's in first place? I know I'm in second place, man. Right now, let me see. Let me see who's in first place. Yeah, well, it's me and um let's see, me, me and Derek. Derek's 30 points behind me in boxing right now. Then Tatara and Freddie Fist.
Yeah, and that season's got what? How many? How much more? One, two, three, four, five more, five more events for the boxing to go. And I'm just clinging to a. I'm clinging to a thirty point lead over Derek right now. A lot of that left. Stephen Terry's winning um, overall. Well, see, Stephen Terry's not in our fantasy league. He's on here, but uh, you know. He's not he's not in our fantasy league. And I got Jamal Hill. I got one more to go. Oh, I'm winning. I'm winning some money now. Oh, I'm winning Muhammad Usman just put me in the money, baby. I got one, two, three, four knockouts, bro. I got four knockouts, man, on this one one. Gosh, but I got, uh, I got that. That one sucks. I got Tiago Santos on that card. <laughs> That's not a good. Let me look at this other one. Let me see. Vincente Luque and Tiago. Oh man. Yo, if Tiago Santos knocks out Jamal Hill, man, that's going to be crazy, bro. NFL, I, I got a fantasy league coming out for NFL football, man. The link is at the top of the description below, man. Just go there and click that link on Facebook, man, and join up, man. And then I'll send you. Uh, uh, then you got to get a Tapology account. If you got a Tapology account, you're good, man. I'll just send you a link over there. All right, we got Vince. Oh yeah. We, um, hey Derek, do you and Yasir uh, play fantasy football? Let me know, man, because uh, I'm gonna start a, a league for fantasy, man. I already got one uh, on on ESPN. Yeah, I don't think Jeff Neal got anything from Vincente Luque, man. Oh, okay. Derek Bailey says, "Yep." Oh man, I'm gonna send. I'm gonna send. Uh, uh, I'm gonna send you the link, then, man. Derek, I'm gonna send you the link. No, nah, no, nah, it's just it's just like we doing right now. It's not a money league. It's just a regular league. It's just ESPN. I I got a league on ESPN, man, and uh, I haven't invited anybody yet, but I started the league already. First round. Oh, nice, nice inside leg kick from Luke. Body sh body kick from uh, Jeff Neal. Nice straight left hand from Jeff Neal. Oh, nice combination from Jeff Neal. Look a. If Jeff fight like this, man, Luke ain't going to have problems, man, unless he takes him to the ground. Nice body kick from Jeff Neal. Nice one-two from Jeff Neal. Jeff Neal fighting right now. Let's see see how, 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 how this works for him. Double jab from Jeff Neal. He ain't being passive. Another jab from Jeff Neal. Leg kick from Luke A. He hurt Luke. He hurt Luke. He hurt Luke. He got Luke hurt bad, bro. He got Luke hurt bad, but Luke caught him. Luke caught him with something. 
Oh, he hurt Luke bad, bro. Luke already leaking. He already leaking. Oh, he caught Luke again with a straight left hand, bro. Nice right hook from Jeff Neal. They're telling him, get off of the fence. Jeff Neal heard him, bro. He could have finished him. Oh, nice double jab from, from Jeff Neal, bro. Yeah, he caught Jeff. You saw that, right, Derek? They're telling them to move. But Jeff, oh, nice uppercut from Jeff Neal. Definitely Jeff Neal around right now. Oh, he, he caught him again and he and he and he dropped. Jeff Neal is fighting. Look at his bloody mess right now, Luke's face, man. This is a good fight, Derek. This is a good fight. Jeff is pacing himself. This is the Jeff Neal that I know. Oh, he, he hurt him again. He hurt him again, bro. He hurt Luke again, bro. I got Jeff Neal in this one, too. Look at that triple jab and the left hook, right hook. Body shot. Oh, he catching him. He catching Luke. Oh, he dropped him again, bro. Dropped him again. He got caught again, bro. Jeff Neal's putting it on him bad, bro. He better take him down. I don't know why he hasn't. Oh, he's catching them. Look at these jabs. Big jabs, man. He going to get caught again. Luke ain't going to get caught again, bro. Look at this jab from Jeff Neal, bro. Oh, he's putting it on Luke, bro. Oh, he stumbled him again. Oh, he's hurt, bro. Luke's out of it, bro. Luke's leg's gone, bro. He's going to lose this fight. He's going to lose this fight, bro. He's already his, his brain's already compromised, bro. Jeff is going to win this damn fight, man. I took him on DraftKings because I had to. Wow, I didn't think Jeff would have a shot at winning this fight, bro. I don't know. It's not over yet, but I'm just saying it doesn't look good for Luke right now, man. I mean, every time he gets hit, his legs are gone, bro. Derek said it. His legs. He has no legs right now, bro. That what you call fight might, must be over, man. That, uh... That uh, uh, Ortiz fight. Let me check. Oh, no, they still fighting. His eye all swole up. Yeah, he getting a KO, man. You see that? Luke's done, bro. Round eight. It's round eight with Virgil Ortez and McKinson. Jeff Neal's hands way better than his hands way better than Luke's, bro. Luke just kicking, bro. But Luke don't want to stand and trade with him no more. He, he ain't going to come. I don't believe he, he, he shouldn't be trying to come forward. You're going to get caught with that left hand. Oh, look at that. 
Yeah, that was a 10 8 round, bro. That was a 10 8 round all day. He dropped him. I mean, he hurt him three times in that round. No, that's a 10 8 round, bro. I don't care what he was throwing back. Nice double jab from Jeff Neal. He's leaking bad, bro. They're telling Jeff, stop waiting, Jeff. Don't wait, Jeff. Let your hands go, man. Jeff is catching him with that straight, with that straight left hand, bro. Come on, Jeff. Nice right hook, Jeff. Yeah, leg kicks and takedowns, man. Yeah, he ain't liking those kicks. Jeff's slowing down right now, man. I don't like it. Yeah, he ain't liking them kicks. Nice straight left hand again from Jeff Neal. Oh, takedown for Jeff Neal. Nice takedown for Jeff Neal. Nice takedown for Jeff Neal. Nice short elbow from Luke. More tie clinch. Big elbows from Jeff Neal. Big elbows from Jeff Neal. Nice jab from Jeff Neal. Nice one two from Jeff Neal. Another one two from Jeff Neal. Oh, big uppercut from Jeff Neal. Left hook. More uppercuts. Luke trying to fight back. Nice body shot from Luke. Nice jab from Luke. Another body shot from Luke. It's nice leg kick from Luke. Jeff didn't like that. Big elbow. Leg kicks. Jeff's slowing down now. Jeff's slowing down now. Nice jab from Jeff Neal. Good movement by Jeff Neal. Five seconds left. Jeff slowed down, man. He might have edged that round. I don't know. Yeah, I think I think he did, man. I think it's up. He got the taste takedown. Plus, he pieced him up against the fence. Yeah, man. I I. I... Yeah, I got I, I I got Jeff Neal, man. I think um that was a 10-8 round the first round. Second round, I give the edge to Jeff Neal. So um I think if he survives here, he wins this fight. But he's definitely slowing down, man. 
I think he should pace himself this round and pick his shots, man. Luke needs a KO right now. Damn, man. I picked Jeff Neal. On DraftKings, man. Third round. Nice straight left hand from Jeff Neal after a leg kick from Luke. Leg kick from Luke. Straight left hand again from uh, Neal. Luke trying to keep that distance, man, with them kicks. One, two from Jeff. Nice, nice left hand from Jeff right down the middle. Luke didn't like that. He started backing up. Oh, look at that, that straight right, that straight left hand from Jeff Neal, man. Luke don't like that. Luke don't like that. Another straight left hand from Je Jeff Neal. Oh, big shot from Jeff Neal again. Stumbled him. Luke is just throwing kicks. Oh, he hurt Luke bad. Oh, he hurt. Oh, it's over. Jeff Neal knocks him out, bro. Jeff Neal knocks Luke out, bro. Wow, man. Wow, man. It's over, bro. Jeff Neal came to fight, bro. I knew he had hands, but he just never uses them in fights, man, like this, man. He did say, he says, I'm ready now. Before this fight, he says, I'm ready. Look at these uppercuts, bro. He threw eight uppercuts, bro, in that sentence. In that 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 sequence, my meant to say, boom! Oh my God, Luke, there's no way I thought you would lose like this to Jeff Neal, man. I never even thought you would lose, bro. But I knew once his brain was was compromised, I said that's it, bro. You're right, Derek. Yeah, that was that was what he should have did, Derek. Take him down and finish him, bro. He, I don't know why Luke didn't try to take this fight to the ground after being hurt. His brain was is compromised, man. He wasn't even thinking right, man. He stays on the center line. That's why he keep getting hit. Absolutely, man. He embarrassed him, Scotty. Scotty boys, yeah, he embarrassed Luke, man. Made him look terrible, man. Come on. We are in the main event, baby. Light heavyweights. This is a five-rounder, baby. We're going to see who got the card. I know one thing. Um, Santos was going to slow down before, um, before Jamal Hill, man. He let Jamal Hill touch him up early, man. His brain going to be – he going to knock a few screws loose. And it's going to be survival mode for um, Thiago Santos, man. But he better be careful of um, 
keeping that range with somebody with the power of um Santos, man. Santos got big hands. Oh yeah, you like Cat Cos comes out to wash Luke too? Yeah, he'll kill, he'll kill Luke. He'll kill Luke, man. He'll kill him. Cosmo to stop both of these fighters, bro. And Rockmanoff. Rockmanoff too, man. Shavkat. Wow, Jeff Neal, man. You looked amazing this fight, bro. This is the Jeff Neal that I remember. This is the Jeff Neal that I remember, bro. The early Jeff Neal. Oh, he tore. He Luke was standing right there in front of him, bro. What? Look at these uppercuts, bro. Ref laid on top of him. Derek Bailey said these last two fights messing with your points. <laughs> I know, man. God, man. He wants to fight Gilbert Burns. Wow, that's right. He beat Bilal Muhammad, too. That's right. He reminds me of uh, Bobby Green, man. The way he throws his combinations. He reminds me of Bobby Green, man. Bobby Green's a tough guy, man. But it's beatable. You know, like Jeff Neal, he's beatable. But he wants uh, Gilbert Burns. Justin Gaethje in the house. Justin, the highlight Gaethje's in the house. Right, Scotty. Why didn't Luke a try to go for a takedown to even try to change the game plan? Shaking my head. Absolutely. What's wrong with what was see? That's what I'm saying about these fighters, man. You don't know who's showing up in the ring, man, mentally. You know, because I'm saying to myself, Luke, you're bugging. Why are you standing with him, man? He already knocked, he already knocked you down and hurt you four or five times in the fight. And here you are still standing in front of him trying to walk him down. Dude, some I'm telling you, people are crazy, man. There's something wrong with people, man. Something's wrong with people, man. Mentally, he he was just wasn't there at all, bro. He wasn't there at all mentally in this fight. And why wouldn't his corner tell him to try to get take the fight to the ground? Why would they? Why would he? I don't know, man. I'm just saying this is this is all this is all all common sense. Derek saying, right, Scotty? Yeah. 100%, Scotty. 100% right, bro. Why? Why would you continue to do the same things that aren't working for you, man? Isn't that a part, isn't that a part of adjusting as the fight goes on? I, I agree, Scotty. Never seen Vincent Luque fight so bad. That was the worst outing I've ever seen of him. I expected him to win this fight. And he just went in there and got knocked out. Come on, man. Come on, Luque, bro. You're way better than that, man. I, I, I knew for sure. I said, man, this guy, no way Jeff Neal beats Vincent J. Luque, man. And goes in there and gets KO'd by him. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I'm telling you. I, I'm telling you. It, it it all starts in the gym, bro. Mentally, you got to be mentally uh, uh, strong, and it's and, it's, and it starts in the gym, man. And the, half of these guys are just like I said. They get to a certain point in their career. I guess Luke probably thought, "Oh, this is Jeff Neal. He's nobody. I I don't have to train that 
that that much. Man, listen, man. I don't care if it's the if it's if it's the the mailman next door getting in there in the cage. Don't you know? Let me tell you something. Somebody like a Khabib or Usman or GSP, you know, they're going to train like they would train if it was a title fight, bro. That's the difference. And that's what I respect. That's what I respect in any fight game, man. Train like you're, I don't care if it's the paper boy you're fighting, bro. Or the mailman. Yeah, and check that out. Check that out. What well, Scotty says. Scotty says Neil hasn't fought for for over a year. In over a year, bro. Are you kidding me? But you know what Jeff Neil said before this fight? He said, "Man, I, he says he says I'm ready. He says I'm a different fight. He said I'm I'm gonna bring a different. Uh, uh, that's the old Jeff Neil that I know." Because when Jeff Neal came in, Jeff Neal was dropping everybody, bro. He was dropping everybody, man. I said, this guy's a problem. I said, Jeff Neal's a problem. Then he started, that. I guess that money got to him, man, and he got complacent, man. And that's what I said about, um, that's what I say about true champions, man. They, they train, they train, they train like their second best, bro. Real champions train like their second best, man. That makes it even worse, Derek. Yeah. Makes it even worse, bro. Man, coming in off of a year layoff, man, and, and he comes in there and KOs you, bro. And you're you're and you're the favorite to win? Nah. That's just that's ridiculous, man. That's uncalled for, bro. There's no way. No way. They're, sh they're showing old clips of uh, Tiago, too, man. They ain't showing the Tiago that had two reconstructive knee surgeries. Because he ain't, he is definitely not the same fighter, bro. He is not the same fighter, bro. Wow, here we go. This is the, this is it. Got off the couch, did a push up and knocked out Luke. <laughs> that's bad. Yo, that's about right. Yo, that's about right, Derek. Scotty Scotty said, "Yep. Yeah, last la, 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 right, Derek." Yeah, he 38, bro. Definitely not the same guy, bro. Yeah, you're right. You're talking about um Santos, right? Yeah. Not the same guy, bro. All right, Jamal Hill fighting out of uh, Chicago, Illinois, by way of Grand Rapids, Michigan. He was a basketball player, Derek. But I heard this kid was nice in basketball, bro. I heard he was nice in basketball. I heard that before. Jamal Hill, I'm going to go check out some highlights of him, man. I, I... Yeah. Derek said, I picked him to do Santos dirty. Yeah, I picked him too, man. I got Hill too, man. I had to take Santos on a couple of my DraftKings cars, man, but nah, I ain't expecting that. I ain't expecting nothing. Hopefully he goes a distance, which I pretty much doubt, but if it does, I'm in good shape. 
I need to go the distance, whether Jamal win, whether Tiago wins or not, man. I just need to go the distance because I'll get points. I'll get more points that way. But if Jamal Hill comes out here and knocks this kid, this guy out, and look how small Jamal Hill is for 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 a light heavyweight. He's not a big light heavyweight, but he's got heavy hands. He's always got a little belly on him, but he's fast. He's fast, man. You know, his hands are just like in that reach that he puts on them people and that ex the extension of his punches is crazy. And he knows how to shorten his hooks, man. Timing, he's got timing and speed. And I'm telling you, when, when, you're, when you're built like him, that's all you really need, man. Catch somebody slipping. And he's got decent takedown defense. Tiago's going to probably try to take this fight to the ground at some point, man, if he starts getting pieced up on the feet. But he's going to gas himself, man, because this boy get back to his feet. But Jamal is one of them kids that he don't care who's in there with him, man. He 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 he's got a maturity about him, man, that I haven't seen in a while, man. In 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 younger fighters, you know what I'm saying? Like he he just doesn't. It doesn't matter who's in there with him, man. Like he's. All right, Santos, what you going to do, man? I don't even know why people were, some people were saying that Thiago Santos, uh, that was a close fight with John Jones. It was not close, bro. Man, he ruined the man's knee, and the man just was not, yeah, I mean, yeah, he landed some shots, but he got he, he got beat up that fight, bro. He got beat up that fight. And some people had the nerve to say, oh, Thiago Santos won that fight. No, he did not, man. No, he did not. Closest fight I ever seen John Jones in was uh, Gustafson and... Uh, What's the other kid's name? The Spanish kid. Uh, 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 mm. Trying to think of this guy's name, man. I'll tell you right now, man. Y'all know who I'm talking about, man. I'll tell you right now, man. What's this guy? This kid's name. Uh, 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 um. Dominic Reyes, Dominic Reyes, my fault. Dominic Reyes and, and Alexander Gustafson. Those are the two closest fights I've seen John Jones in in his entire career, man. That's it. The rest, everybody else, he just he crushed them, bro. Crushed everybody else. Everybody else, man. I mean, literally just beat everybody else up. And they had a split decision against Thiago Santos against John Jones. I was like, what? Man, yeah, yeah, they just didn't like John at that time. John was doing all that mess, man. They were, just, <laughs> they were trying to get Johnny Boy, man. 38 years old, man. That's a dinosaur, man. I call them dinosaurs, man. Uh, 22 and 10. 31 years old for Jamal Hill. He's young, six foot four. He's got a two inch height advantage and a three inch reach advantage. He's 10 and one with one no contest. Minus 300 favorite. One of the biggest favorites on the card. Let's go.
Jamal Hill looking at him like he's crazy. That's the thing about Jamal. He don't care, man. Jamal just be looking at you like, what? Herb Dean. All right, here we go. Look at the way Thiago looking at him. They they staring each other down, bro. Jamal's like, you are not finna steal my shine. Thiago's like, yo, you young buck, man. I can't let you beat me in front of my family, man. I can't let you do it. Out of Grand Rapids, Michigan. Number 10 ranked. Jamal, Sweet Dreams, Hill. I like that name. Look, 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 look at Tiago. Tiago saying, let's go. Tiago looking like a freaking gladiator in there, man. 22 and 10, though, man. Come on, man. Plus 250, underdog. Woo! All right, Jamal Hill, man. You better come in here and show up and show out. But Jamal, Jamal looks small, but watch how heavy this kid's hands are, bro. Watch how heavy his hands are for being so... He doesn't look like he got no power, bro. Oh, stare down. Look at the way they're looking at each other. Oh, it's on, man. Don't blink in this one, man. Scotty Boy says he'll buy TKO. Don't blink, guys. I know it's going to be a KO either way. Either way, it's going to be a KO, KO in this fight. Here we go. Oh, big leg kick. Big leg kick from Tiago. The last three fights, he's only landed a total of 11 significant strikes. That's how fast his fights have been. <laughs> Jab by Jamal Hill. Oh, just missed by Thiago Santos. Jamal stalking him, man. He got to be careful, though. Thiago swings heavy. Front kick. Thiago trying to already trying to go for a takedown. Thiago, Thiago can't gas himself, man. Because Jamal got good takedown defense. Oh, he he got him down to a knee, but he's back up. Body shots coming in, knees coming in from Jamal. Thiago's taking way too much energy trying to get this takedown. 
That's a lot of energy trying to get this takedown. Big shot and big knees from uh, Jamal Hill. Big body shots from Jamal Hill. Nice, nice knee to the cup from Jamal Hill. <laughs> they had to stop the action real quick so Tiago can recover. Yeah, now they're uh, they changed the rules. Five minutes for um, eye pokes, and they're allowed to wear um, knee knee um, knee supports and ankle supports in the ring. Those are the new rules. You know, like those nylon um, sleeves, ankle sleeves and knee sleeves. You're allowed to use them. All right, they touch. Here they go. They go, they go Santos on, 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 on his. That's the thing about Santos. When he gets hit, he likes to get get back. Once he takes a good shot, he'll he'll try to come forward and get it back. Front kick. Oh, big kicks. Oh, big, big right hand from Jamal Hill lands. Jamal trying to cut the cage off now, but Santos is dangerous. Double jab from Jamal. Jamal just trying to measure him and catch him. Santos on the back foot, backing up. Ah, wow, close round. Oh, Hill got the more better shots that round. I mean, the most shots that round. Chago Sanz was just out of range, though. He's swinging really hard. I believe that's more of a you better not come in here, you know, that type of. That's why he's swinging so hard. He's just trying to give Jamal something to think about. But Tiago was working really hard to get a takedown. I'm sure that's going to come back to play a factor later on in the fight. He's carrying a lot of oxygen, bro, with the muscles, man. It's a lot of oxygen. All right, here we go. Second round. A oh, little mouse over the left eye of um of uh, Jamal Hill. Inside leg kick for Jamal. Watch the watch Santos. Another inside leg leg kick. He likes to come forward. Another leg kick from Jamal. He's starting to mess with that. He's starting to mess up that 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 that, that lead leg, man. Scotty, you got Santos? Nah, I, I, I like I like I like uh Hill that round. He was landing a lot of body shots on the inside, you know, when he had him in the clinch. I don't count the clinch, man. I count who's more active, and I think Hall, uh, Hill is more active. If you're looking at the punch count, 22 to 9 right now in favor of Hill.
Oh, nice body kick from uh, Santos. Oh, takedown from Santos. But he'll he'll get right back up. He'll get right back up to his feet. Good takedown though. But I know Jamal Hill. He's got he's good. Big knee. He knocked a mouthpiece out. He need the mouthpiece out of Santos. Big shots from Hill. Oh, he he hurt Santos. He hurt Santos. He caught him. He caught Santos and hurt him, bro. Santos right now is dazed, bro. He dazed, bro. He dazed, bro. Santos is dazed, bro. Get out of there, uh, uh. Get out of there, Jamal. Oh, nice left hook. Boom. Uh-oh. Hill's starting to connect. Nice left. Oh, Santos swinging back. Oh, they fighting now. Santos is Santos is Santos is gassing, bro. He's gassing, bro. He about to get KO'd. Santos gonna get KO'd, bro. He gassing already. He's still dangerous, but he's gassing. I can tell the way his body language. Yeah, he he right now he huffing and puffing, man. Santos huffing and puffing. Yeah, they both they both kind of they both kind of gassing though. But Santos don't look good at all, bro. He puffing. He huffing and puffing. One good shot, bro. And he's swinging heavy, too. Look at that jab. Nice jab from uh, Jamal. Oh, nice, le nice, nice right hook from uh, Jamal Hill lands. Yeah, he's tired, bro. Tiago's tired. Tiago slows down. I told you he slows down big time, bro. Yeah, he's hurt. Santos don't look good at all, bro. He don't look good at all, bro. He's stumbling already. He's stumbling. He's stumbling, bro. Santos gas, bro. Santos is gas, bro. He's gassed. I'm telling you right now, man. He ain't gonna last long in this fight. But uh, Hill's kind of um slowing down too. He's picking his shots now, man. He's. But uh, Santos is gas, bro. His body language is all around. He's stumbling like he's drunk. He'll gonna knock him out, man. He'll gonna catch him. Because he's winging the air with all that muscle, man, and all that grappling. Oh, he caught him on the chin. Yeah, that was a nice round, man. Round number three. All right, cardio. Santos, Santos cardio is the worst right now, man. I'm telling you. 
I can tell. He might throw some big shots early in this round, but nice inside leg kick from Jamal Hill. Body kick from Jamal Hill. Oh, he's trying for he's trying for a takedown again. He's trying. Oh, he he gets him down. No, nah, he can't keep him down. He can't keep him down. I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't know why Hill ain't trying to get that standing guillotine on him, man. With his head down between his legs like that, man. Put that standing guillotine on his behind, bro. Santos going to be gassed if he gets out of this. Yeah, he's going he's going to gas, bro. Santos going to gas, bro. He's going to gas. He already gassing. Look at him holding on to the cage. Body shots from uh, Jamal Hill. He's got Santos on his. Shots coming into the head from Jamal Hill. He took Jamal down again. You got to be careful not to give your back up. He's taking shots to the face. These guys are both these guys are both uh tired, bro. Nice shots coming in from Santos to the side of the head. Hill back to his feet again. Nice elbow from Jamal Hill. Get out, Jamal. Get out, Jamal. Big knees. Big knees from Jamal. Jamal getting tired too, bro. Big shots on the on the from uh from Hill. Big shots from Hill. Big knee from Jamal Hill, but a nice body shot from Thiago. Big shots coming. Big shots coming in from uh, Hill. That's the end of that round. 
Tiago is out of it, bro. That's what I'm saying, Derek, man. What's wrong with, with Hill? Why didn't he try the standing guillotine, man? He had it every single time. John, yo, John Jones is known for that standing guild team, man. He don't even hesitate to put it in, man, and just the one he put um, Machida to sleep with, man. That'll really, that'll really take uh, take the wind away from um, Santos. All right, Jamal, man. Jamal might be too gassed to finish him, bro. I know one thing, Thiago's not landing many punches at all, man. Jamal's still landing more punches, even though he's, you know, grappling with them. And Jamal doesn't go, go, he doesn't go late in these fights like this, man. Santos swinging hard. Nice right hook from Santos. Santos showing showing that he's in this fight, man. Santos is in shape, bro, though. It looks look like he is now. That second round. Oh, big. Big shots from, from Jamal from Hill. Nice body kick. Oh, big shots. Big shots from Hill. Santos throwing big shots back. Oh, but he drops. He drops him. He drops Santos. Oh, it might be over. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh, that's it. That's it. It's over. It's over, bro. It's over. That's it. He KOs him. He KOs him, bro. Jamal Hill stopped him, bro. Wow, Jamal Hill. Jamal, you better work on your cardio, bro. Your cardio sucks. You ain't going nowhere with that with that type of cardio, bro. You ain't going nowhere with that type of cardio, bro. Yeah, I agree, Scotty. It seems like no everyone has no fight IQ today, man. Why didn't he try the standing guillotine on 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 Santos, man? That that was crazy. He caught him with an uppercut. That's what hurt him. Oh no, it was the overhand right. Hill by TKO, bro.
Yeah, I knew he was a, his his gas tank was empty, bro. Oh man, that fight should be over, man. One hundred percent finishes tonight, man. One hundred percent finishes tonight, bro. And I went, I went, I went eighty percent. Uh, I went eighty percent decisions tonight. Can you imagine that, bro? Wow, man. Every fight ended in a finish tonight, man. And I went eighty percent decisions. Come on, bro. I suck. Hill by TKO. Boom. Herb gave Sansa. Yeah, he did, Derek. Yeah, I would have stopped that sooner, bro. You had Hill KO. Three, Derek. Oh man. You need to be in better shape, Jamal, man. If you want that next level, man. That was that was terrible, man. Nah, I don't know if you Yami Bohovich, man. His grappling's better than Tiago, man. Yang get you down, man. He'll mess around and finish you, bro. You better get your cardio up. Yeah, he gassed. Look at him. He can't even talk. He got it done. He got it done. He had the gas tank to get it done, so I can't. 121 total strikes. <laughs> Yo, he tried to kill Tiago at the end, bro. Wow, man. We did it again, bro. Let me see what. Let me see something. Let me see. Virgil Ortiz is 19 and 0. He won by corner stoppage from a body shot in round number nine. Wow, Virgil Ortiz by TKO in round number nine by a body shot. I, I think I picked eight. I think I picked Virgil in eight, but I know I picked him to stop Michael McKinson. So that might that might do me some good on Champ Ross there. But yo, man, people, man, we done done it again, man. Um, Guys in the chat, man, check out. Be looking out on uh, Tapology because I'm about to put in a new season, man. This season's uh, this season, this season here is over, man. And um, I came out the yeah, I won, I won this one, I won this one. Derek won the last one. Um, 
Yeah, I, I won this one with 3,120 points. Y'all see it was 2,940. Freddie Fist was 2,750. Stephen Terry was in second place officially, but he's, he's, uh, Stephen Terry is only on tap files. He's not a part of our fantasy league. So I have to go by, you know, who's in a Derek, Derek made a huge comeback, man. Yeah, Derek made a huge comeback. Derek got 495 points tonight, man. Um, so he won uh, on this card. He Derek Derek took first place on this card. But uh, that's it, man. That's that's it for this season, man. So it's one to one, Derek, man. I'm coming for you in the next. I'm coming for you, Derek, on the next one, man. Y'all see it, man. Be ready, man. Y'all look out for the um, new season because I'm sending them out. Tonight, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it tonight and send out the invites on Tapology. Um, Scotty, if you're on Tapology, give me your um. I got a uh. If you got a Tapology, send send um. Put it in the link, man. What's your what's your username over there, man? Um, I gotta send Sean one. I know I gotta send Sean Spencer one as well. So I'll uh, when I do that, uh, I'll send them out, man. But if you got a tapology, Scotty, man, um, give me your username, man, in the uh, chat. If not, go make make one, man, and I'll, I'll uh, you know, I'll get it too. Yeah, peace, y'all. See you, man. You guys look out for the uh, tapology because I, I may put. I, I'm I'm pretty sure I'm gonna put the contender series on there for this Tuesday. So don't don't forget. Before Tuesday, man, go into your topology, man, and put in. It's going to be five matches for that contender series. I'm going to throw it in there. But peace and blessings to all my brothers in the chat, man. Scotty, Scotty boy, y'all see it to Tara, Derek Bailey, um, all the other people, man. Let me see who else we had in here, man. I like to, I like to shout everybody out, man. Uh, uh, chemo, chemo. Um, Shufa, we got Chemo came through in the house, man. Shout out to Chemo, man. Subscribe to the channel, guys, if you haven't. And um, yeah, that's about it, man. We we uh, yeah, man, come through, man, and uh, check us out. Already got Sean in there. Got Sean Spencer. But uh, peace and blessings to all my brothers, man, and enjoy the rest of your weekend, man. And uh, with that, I'm out. Peace. RKH, Q&A. ZMVP, Devin Blocker came through. Y'all know who y'all is. <laughs>